The thoughts, views, and opinions expressed by this podcast as well as its hosts are for entertainment purposes only. I repeat, it is not serious. It is not real. No one is exposing, revealing, indicting, or telling you anything about themselves. Also, we do not encourage you to try this at home. We are trained professionals who do not have your best interest at heart or our own. <laughs> Enjoy the show. Microphone check, one, two, what is this? Welcome to episode 601 of the Joe Button Podcast. I'm your humble, gracious, grateful, and highly favored host, Joe Button, here with a few of my nearest and dearest. You've never heard of that. All Joe right. <laughs> uh oh, Bionic Six is back. <laughs> Mel is back without them black boots. Woo-hoo. All right. All right. <laughs> Mel left them black boots at home. Come on now. Hey, we read the comments. Oh, yeah. We read the comments. Right. Welcome back. M4. <laughs> hey. Hey, man, we were showing our ass while you was going. Yeah, we were bugging out. We were oh, misogynists. We I saw it. Womanizers. I saw Army it. Army supporters. We were everything <laughs> bad. <laughs> we was doing forbidden dances. Yeah, we was bad. <laughs> Listen yeah. to forbidden we, music. Yeah, we, 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 okay. we wilded out. I, no, we I got our it. shit out before you got back. Yeah, yeah, we I did. Yeah, I we did. That. We had to get that shit off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it was good. It was good. As, it, was good. <laughs> it was good. So everybody's here. Gang is here. Mel is here. Flip is here. Ish is here. Ice is here. Parks is here. Corey's here. Poe is here. Uh, Erickson is here in the back and some other niggas in the back. Uh, and Tanner's here by remote. How's everybody doing? How y'all feeling? Good. Feeling great. Huh? Feeling good. Y'all looking good, smelling good, huh? Mm-hmm. This weather? How do you not feel good? Word. It's beautiful out there. I saw spring. It was hollering at me the other day. Spring was hollering at you? Yeah. What, was, what was it saying? Clarity. I'm coming, daddy. <laughs> so Spring calls you daddy yeah. Boy the arrogance in him <laughs> Wow He is the uh, Mac she, she was right there. I'm coming daddy Wow uh, Get ready Get your girlfriend in, ready in Central Park walks <laughs> Mr. Flowers <laughs> bike. Yeah. Flower uh, day, What's where you get the flowers? 1-800 what? <laughs> what? What's that shit? <laughs> From you flowers <laughs> <laughs> What's up man? Parks what's up? I'm chilling man I'm chilling yeah, nigga, you lost the Grammys, nigga. So yeah, whatever. Damn, <laughs> I was son. there though. I'm, I, listen, that's where I'm at today. I'm yeah, you look nice fun. too, y'all. I ain't gonna hold Thanks, you. I forgot man. to tell you. Thank yeah, you, man. Dude, you look kind of Pierce Brosnan in this. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Double O Seven. Had to put some shit on. Yeah, you did. Had to put some shit on. Fierce Brosnan. <laughs> <laughs> Fierce. Fierce Brosnan on him. This nigga's stupid, yo. <laughs> Something wrong with you, <clears> yo. Word. This guy's a. I'm in a silly mood, man. You don't say. I'm, I'm in a silly mood. Oh, That's different. Fierce pride. <laughs> Come on, what's important? What's not important? Um, no, I don't care. Come sports, on. Sports, music. A few things happen in both. Yeah. Lots of stuff happening. The goat goaded. Oh, let me let y'all know. Mel been here trying to talk about everything that we've been talked about. She died in the pod. <laughs> <laughs> she no. brought up mad topics from two weeks ago. I know, but you, you know, I was it. I was here in spirit. You missed it. I yeah, know. Yeah. She missed it. I know. Expounding upon it or I us. The things. It or us. The whole the whole. There we go. Yes, the Aww. whole thing, energy, everything, all of y'all. Yes. All right. But well, we you're here two. now. That's all I Thank matters. you. We have two full boards. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm about to laugh at all of this stuff. <laughs> yeah. I mean, we got Super Bowl this weekend. We do. Everybody's we do. looking forward to... I would go I would go so far to say more people are looking forward to Riri's performance than the actual game. No. Nah. No, I don't know what you're no. talking about. <laughs> no. I don't that's know what you're talking about. Let me tell you, you what you did. That's, you more that's, a select that. group, that's a select yeah. group of women that yeah. you look at. You can stop, yes. stop that. And it stops the right there. The entire Navy. Yes. Well, yeah. Which is but huge. That's cool. Huge. Yeah, cool. <laughs> We're going to find your Adderall deal. We're going to take them Adderalls away from you, little, whoop his little ass. Miss Missy. <laughs> the them shits is a little too potent. Navy. Okay, well. Submarine your ass out of here. Niggas want to see the Super Bowl. Mahomes. Yeah. I'm looking forward to Rihanna, too, but hey, not more than the hey, game check, check this out. There's a reason them commercials cost that much, and it ain't because of Rihanna. Indeed. Mm. I might no. go to the store when she go on. <laughs> <laughs> I, ain't even decide, I ain't even decided if I'm sticking around. I mean, it should be on YouTube. Like, <laughs> yeah, I'll see it on the shade room or somewhere. That's not valid. Honey Habanero or Buffalo, dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Nah, I'm playing. All right. She better kill 
Kill it. What you gonna play? Chip from how many years ago? It don't matter. I right, stop. Them I'm, is different slaps. Stop, right. Them is different I'm, slaps. I'm joking with you. She got some man. shit. That, of course that, she that, do. Niggas gonna go crazy in that building. They you think she gonna play? Throw it up. Throw it up. You think she gonna do that? She think she gonna do that? She absolutely should. I love that song. That's what I was doing yesterday, oh, trying to figure out what record she, she would play. So many me, slaps. It look all listen. All the players are looking forward to her sh- her performance. Oh, okay, who did you speak to? Here you go. Would you act like you got the some type Eagles, of Eagles. They had video of them getting off the bus, and they were all singing a different Rihanna song. Everybody's looking forward to this. I hate, I hate to, to tell you this. Look, no the the Eagles looking forward to a little bit more than the Rihanna show, bro. I promise you. I think that and because she's fine, it works. Like she got y'all. She's she got y'all. She got. I'm talking about her. Because Mel is fine. She get to start with the and we got him. She got him. <laughs> nah, man, no way. <laughs> Look at that board, Mel. We don't give a fuck about Riri's performance right now. Okay, right okay, now. okay, right okay. now. But Park said he cares a little bit. I mean, I'm a we care, care. Yeah. but I'm a fan. Fan. we all care. I'm there's a, a football game that we but also care about. There's a game about. coming on. It's a good game. It should a, be a so good the game, game. The game outweighs the performance. Okay. Yes. All right. Well, let's talk about what? some predictions. I'm with y'all. I'm just saying. I'm this out. ain't this ain't like why are these two teams there. Nobody gives a fuck. This ain't that. Yo, pull up the Billboard list of the top ten Super Bowl performances. There well, one? the top nine because number it's one is unanimous across the board for everybody. It Beyonce. Should be. It should be. No, no, it's not. What's number one? Prince. 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 I know he. I know it he rained while he played Purple Rain. <laughs> like in Purple Rain. Yeah, that, <laughs> that was come crazy. On, you wasn't ever beating that. That was crazy. Nobody was beating that. He made it rain for the performance. But but I'm arguing with their two through ten. All right. So we had. So you just want you want to read one through. One no two. no no. To read two. Okay. One we know. <laughs> <laughs> one is him. Timothy. Two is you two. Uh, yeah. Nah. 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 <laughs> nah. nah. Not them two. I don't even remember that. <laughs> Me either. Three is last year's. What was last year? Doc, Dr. Dre, Snoop. Gay. I'm not going to. I'm not going to. Look, 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 That shit shouldn't be in no fucking number three either. Should not. Beyonce's not even in the top They paid to get that in number three. Four is Madonna. All of these are fire. Four is Madonna. I don't remember that. I don't remember. She might have went nuts, but I don't remember. Five is Bruce Springsteen in the East Bruce Springsteen in the name. East Street Band. <laughs> I remember that. I remember that. I remember that. Oh, you do? Six is Beyonce. <laughs> you can't put that Dr. Dre and them shit over the Beyonce performance. Boom. You run right to that. No, get the Bruce Springsteen too, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't remember it like get the that. Ain't, ain't that, that they, they don't go, don't write right no, to Dre and our no, 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 I'm not bro. saying it like that. <laughs> okay, who's number seven? Rolling Stones. Okay, keep on going. Eight is Lady Gaga. Okay. I remember that. Mm-hmm. Nine, nine is Paul McCartney. Child, good night. Ten is Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson number 10? I don't Bullshit. remember. I don't remember. And one is, is one yeah, Prince? Like either, really. You know who I'm surprised isn't in the top 10? Mike came out at Summer Jam one time, I think. He did. Hey, he Joe, did. stop. Well, <laughs> <laughs> Why you said that? I'm chilling, I'm chilling, I'm chilling, I'm chilling. I'm chilling this part, I'm chilling this part. He shook, he shook that whole shit I'm up. I'm chilling this part. Just stood there. Shook it up. The you stadium. Know That's when Dame minutes. and them was about to rob. They robbed that nigga backstage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The stadium was in. Yo, you saw that? They, they, took, they took all his publishing. They just stood there. I was there. You was there? This nigga, you just, why you? Sorry. Yeah, nigga. How was the crowd? He was Something in the crowd. You never seen did you pass out? Exactly. Nigga. You pass out? Look, Chris never did that. <laughs> purple rain with purple rain. Get the fuck out of here, nigga. Sit your ass down. Watch your mouth about the uh, purple one as you wear purple. Okay. <laughs> He's the purple one today. All right, storylines for this game. Let me get mine right out of the way. I'm rooting for the Chiefs. I have the Eagles winning. I think the Eagles are stacked. And I don't know. I want to see Pat Mahomes and Andy Reid get more than one. Jalen Hurts, you can, you, we got time for you later. That's true. For me, it's it's quarterback versus team. That's the argument in building a, a franchise. You know, teams are like, yo, get the, the young quarterback. Doesn't matter if you build everything else great. Versus the quarterback that's got not the greatest team. I'm rooting for the Eagles, I guess, but it's hard to root against Patty yeah. and Andy. I'm rooting for the Eagles, just like team, complete package, mm-hmm. offense, defense, Pause. special teams. <laughs> <laughs> they got they got it all over there. It's it's going to be hard to beat them. Y'all know where I stand. I think Mahomes and them win by at least two touchdowns. Eagles. I just, I just think his greatness is that. Eagles. Has anybody yeah. betting on the game? 
No, I'm scared know. about this one. I, what's the line? You know what the line is? Uh, Eagles by one and a half last time I checked. I don't know if that's changed, though. They're the, they're the favorite. Really? Yeah. I might take that bet. Want to bet? Sure. What are you betting? You tell me. Oh, man, I just had a <laughs> fucking sexual harassment joke. <laughs> yeah. It would have been perfect right there. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> yeah, right. No, come on, no, from him. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't me. You know, had to jam me up. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, Super Bowl, Travis Kelsey. And I want Travis Kelsey to get one. Another one? I do want. I'll do one. I want his brother to get one, too, though. Like Travis is going to get a few. That other brother, he better enjoy this trip. <laughs> Chris, he, Chris was there. Chris, he didn't get one. He might have been there when they got the last. Oh one. yeah, he was there when he got. He yeah, got one already. He so might he, got one. He already. got one already. Yeah. Man, it's Eagles. Let's go. All right. Man, it's the Eagles. Man, Shut it's the Eagles. Fuck up. <laughs> and I just uh, don't feel like handing a niggas' mouth all summer. Oh yeah, you guys are oh, all yeah, yeah, NFC yeah. East heads. So yeah. yeah, I can see why you'd be rooting against now them. I can. Oh, I don't care. We won Coach of the Year. That's our Super Bowl. Huh? Hey, actually, we won Coach of the Year. Uh, shout out to DeBall. And shout out to uh, Garrett Wilson and uh, Sauce. Sauce, yeah. Yes. Who won Rookies offensive and, and defensive, defensive rookie, rookie of, the year. of the year on the same team. Only happened twice before. Shout out to both of them. Uh, let's keep it on sports. Check this out. Eric says, zoom in on me. Zoom in on Joe. You got me? It's been about <laughs> five years. Five years of all of you Brooklyn Net fans, honestly, <laughs> you guys been wearing your little merchandise around the town. Yeah, that's a fact. Your though. little jackets. That's a fact, though. Y'all been outside. sitting front yeah, row. Bro. KD, KD, huh? Bitch ass niggas. <laughs> Y'all been at that little wine snack bar down there at the Barclays. <laughs> Boy, y'all been showing out. Mm -hmm. Y'all been showing out. Y'all been showing out so bad. The Barclays called me one game and was like, yo, you want tickets to the game? <laughs> I was like, sure, I might come. <laughs> they was like, we'll call you back. Don't you know they ain't never called back? Mm. They ain't never called back. I called them niggas back. Hey, hello. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you got them tickets? It was Memphis. They was, remember. You remember? They were like, nah, nah. Nah, some other niggas coming through that day. So, nah, fall back. We don't need... Whoa! <laughs> That's disrespectful. That sounds like some hate. That is. That is. That's that disrespectful. Like well, you could do shit like that when Kevin Durant and yeah, Kyrie yeah. and James Harden, I think, might have been on the team at they that was. time. You could play those types of games mm -hmm. where, hey, got a ticket, taking it back. Got a ticket, taking it back. But now, <laughs> now they might call me. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, come say courtside, please. Please. Yeah. Please. Please. <laughs> please. <laughs> They go, they we need some sauce over here. here. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> so who's left in, in, the, in Brooklyn? Ben Simmons. That you know? It's ben Simmons over okay. there. Okay. Yeah. It's the Ben Simmons show, baby. Ah. What? Yeah, this is perfect music. <laughs> <laughs> hey. I know you know that. <laughs> I do. I, I had to hear y'all mouth during that little 19 game win streak. Y'all stupid ass fans start telling me about Nick's, Nick Clacton, Claxton trying to cook up. <laughs> nah. Send Kyrie little cooking artistic po poetry emotion ass to Dallas. <laughs> right? Let him piss them off over there. I, I wish Rick Carlisle was there so we could really get some action over there. <laughs> and we'll send KD to Phoenix so Chris Paul can get him one. It go. Yeah, it's over. I yeah. shouldn't see none of you Nets fans no more. I shouldn't hear from y'all no more. You won't hear from them. At least the new ones. They, they wouldn't have no fans. There wasn't that fans before them. They were Kyrie fans or KD fans. Yeah. There wasn't that fans. Nah, nah. Stay right there. Keep showing your love and support for Cam Thomas. <laughs> uh, Joe Harris. <laughs> ah. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Din Dinwiddie. <laughs> Dinwiddie. 25. <laughs> Fuck y'all. <laughs> Good for y'all asses. And go Phoenix and Dallas. It's the Ben Simmons the fuck out of here. I'm so sick of them Net fans. All of them. I wish I, wish I knew y'all names still. Hmm. No, for the real. fans. My friends that oh, are yeah. fans. No, yeah. uh, like, niggas, did a, that, niggas did a lot, yo. They did. Yeah, they did, they did a lot with that running around screaming, Brooklyn, and we run the town now. They was dissing the Knicks. Dissing the, we own New York. Man. And this is from back it. This is from back when y'all put that uh, Russian billionaire nigga on the building across from the garden. Mm -hmm. it, that was rude and hurtful is what it was. <laughs> Shouldn't have did that. Uh, yeah, I keep it up. 
I keep it up when the beef is up. up. So yeah, uh -huh. bye. I don't care if y'all won all the other night. They still winning. They got a couple niggas over there. Yeah, still. they do. Then we're about to go nuts. Okay, so do you guys think that CP3 is actually is gonna get his ring? There's a good chance. No. That, no. That no. <laughs> still <laughs> no. <laughs> that's, that's the bad part. Still no. Nah, that team is stacked. No, they ain't. No, they ain't. Shit. No, they ain't. No, they ain't. Where's the weakness? The bench? Yeah. Yes. They gave away three or four good. They whole bench is depleted. I, I don't know that they could be Boston without a bench. But not with no bridges. If they get to the finals. They gave bridges away. That's uh -huh. the, that was the glue. Bridges is a monster. You know he know about glue. He built houses. <laughs> <laughs> you glue them shits together? Yeah, you know. A little something. No nails. No screws. We just glue. <laughs> just glue. And those are the only trades I care about. There's a lot of the trades. Nah, Lakers made some moves. Lakers made well, moves. I don't care. Oh. No, those are the two big ones, though. Them two. As a Laker fan, you care about the other moves, no? Of course. But they didn't shake up the NBA nah. like that. They ain't really worth no, talking no. about like that. I understand. The Knicks got Josh Hart. I know. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> LeBron passes Kareem. The GOAT. Like I told y'all, he would. We all knew it was coming. We knew it. Mm. What do y'all y'all know where I stand on this? So the floor is you guys's. Kareem is an old ass hater. I said it earlier. <laughs> <laughs> he's old. He's mad. I love to have the camera after every shot. I just think he go forgot right. that to be at four K. We can catch him in four K hating. No, he was just too much of a hater where he couldn't hide it. Some nigga, you just you, you couldn't even turn that off if he wanted to. He was bitter. He's so he like that shit. It's disgusting. Nasty. Right. He shouldn't do that though. Why? He, he paved the way. For guys like LeBron to do that, he was there when they was throwing rocks at players. You know, he was there. Remember the rocks we shell up? He was around for those. No, I'm with Kareem. What? I'm with him. Why? Because you were hating us, huh? Because that, that, that my too. record should have been, should have sat there a little longer, I feel like. And I think this guy's on steroids. <laughs> 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 I did it the right way. I was also an activist. True. So it's LeBron. This guy I say Bron too. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Nah, not nah, nah. dog. LeBron. Y'all want to have that talk? Different levels. Talk about it. Talk about it. Y'all want to have that talk? They don't want to have that talk, Joe. It's different levels. I don't want to have it because I'm on LeBron's side. But there's a difference between my son activists and Carl Lewis activists. Yo, he, whoa, okay, easy. There's a difference between what my son and them is doing and mm -hmm. what niggas had to do back then. <laughs> It's very different. It's different. It's very, very, Shout the mics. very different. I'm okay. not making a race here. I'm not I'm making not, a race here. It's, it's different, but they both still. I'm sure Kareem is looking at LeBron like, yeah, I, I see all the activism. Got it. Got yeah. it, my G. <laughs> it is a difference, though. Got it, my G. We're completely different. That's what I, I'm just giving you. Y'all asked me reasons no, why he's hating. No, we difference? can talk about this on Patreon, but I disagree. I, yeah, I you disagree, disagree with what? what? Same, it's the same. Y'all disagree with what? You talking about LeBron activism is the same as Kareem's? It's I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm saying. Wait, wait, let them say what they're saying, please. It's a, it's a different day and time. Technology is different, but I think the activisms are parallel. And I got more power. I can use my power to well, be an activist in different ways. Do you remember what was happening? Wait, wait, hold on. Hold on. Yo, what do these? I remember what happened what back in the day. You this is not back through? in the day. That's, that's what point. we're that's saying. Exactly. But we're saying that so for the times of today to be an activist today, yeah, I'm not dealing with what you dealt with. I'm dealing with different shit here, sure. and I can I can. So you agree make with us? Things happen. I so you I, agree, so I you just, agree with us, but you're wording it in a way that sounds like you disagree. I'm we're saying that, good. that activism of today is not the activism of. Then. Yesteryear. Oh, okay. And you yeah, agree. I'll, I'll agree with that. I'll say that world today is not the same world. True. Everything is different. different. So yeah, not just the activism. But we're not talking it. about the world. But it all falls in, about, it all is in parallel. About, like how? That world back then cost for that activism. You're trying to back open then. it up to world. Look, yeah, look, yeah, look, yeah, look, yeah, look, 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 look. Oh, y'all want to. He's saying like the look, times. Look, look. He's saying the times. The times were it called for different levels of activism. That's a very vague point that the world was different back then. What is what is your activism point though? That I, living in that world, then you had to be an act if, to be an activist. How can I say it? When you, you when no. back then the activism came with an enormous amount of risk, more so than it does physical. now. Yes, I know. More risk, physical. just physical. Just That's not true. Board. That's not true. More, more physical. Y'all can't just say only physical. I didn't say only. I said more. I said just. Mm. I said but more physical. To say more means that you know how much mental anguish uh, somebody was going through at the T time today. Today, in this cancel culture, today in the internet generation, and today in the cameras in your face every single second of the day, it, it carries a different burden. 
both are, are are burdensome, but this one is just different. I don't think it's more or less. LeBron is potentially putting billions of dollars on um, his shoulders to get potentially taken away for what he believes. Shit that I just watched the whatchamacallit doc, the Mahmoud Abdul Rauf doc. I watched it. Again, Damn. the stand that LeBron is potentially taking today, he's just a polarizing figure in the NBA. They can't cancel him. But Mahmoud Abdul Rauf just got blackballed or whiteballed 20 years ago, 25 years ago for the same shit. But for taking his political stand or his stand against certain shit, they kicked him out the league. LeBron is potentially putting sponsors and the all these other things on weighing him out did for they what throw, he believes. Did they throw Molotov bombs at, no. at, uh, no. at Mahmoud Abdul Rauf's home? Yes. They burned his house down. Did they his do brand that? new did house they, that was getting they, built, they burned they, it down. They do They're that. doing his daughter's did room? They do that? Yeah, did they do that to him and every single family member that they had, everybody that they know? Bro, you asked me a question, I answered it. And I asked, now, I'm at, now I'm asking a new question. Did they do that? I don't know about everybody. Okay. I don't know. I know they burnt his brand new you know house what? that was getting I'm built down. I agree to disagree. Y'all ain't That's cool. No, Y'all no, ain't, cool. ba ain't baiting me. I'm, I'm not saying they both, they both no, were. You can't shit. give no, no, no. I'm just it. saying it's you different levels of activism. activism. You can't give it to them. I'm not no. giving it. Okay, so no, wait. No, I have a question. <laughs> Back in the days. They think what they think. I think what I think. Okay, so I have a question. One doesn't negate the other. That's all. I have a question. I have a question. So everybody's been making a big deal out of what, you know, Kareem looked like in the stands. You know, they were, you know, every time LeBron made a shot, the camera went to him mm. and he looked salty. Has anybody actually spoken to him? Like, interviewed he's him? Publicly he's, said, all night. He's, he's publicly said some anti bron things. Yeah. He's publicly said some things. They spoke to him all night. He, uh, Mike and camera was in his face that entire night. As soon as Brian broke the record, they walked Kareem out there on the court to hand him, to pass a basketball to him, and he spoke, he said a couple words. He said all the right things in that moment and then right after the game, but everything else leading up to this moment showed you ain't want to be there and you wasn't supporting this. True. You was hating on this nigga the whole trip. I don't want to watch my record being broken either. I'm sorry, I, I, I don't. Records are meant to be broken. Sorry. I understand that. I'm not going to I'm not gonna celebrate the motherfucker. I'm absolutely not. So going you'll be to. an old ass hater over there with Kareem. I exactly. guess yes, I will. Play a hater. <laughs> That's it. Turn I your head around. <laughs> <laughs> lay on the ground, but don't it's lay It's the same head. shit we see happening in music. <laughs> it's the same shit enough. we see happening everywhere. It's what happens is the older, older ones yeah, will sit there yourself. and say, "It was harder for us, so we don't respect it for you." We don't respect the path that you're taking, but hey, that's that's exactly. evolution. True. That's evolution, exactly. my nigga. That's what happens. Look up. I took those. Bumps and bruises, so the next crop, crop don't have to take NBA them. NBA is soft. You can't now hate them for that. If, especially if you were sincere in your people moving. Now you want to talk about activism and all okay. that other shit. Talk if you it. stood in, yo, I want my next generation to have it easier than I have it, and I don't want them to have to go through the trials and tribulations I went through, then you should appreciate the LeBron shit. Because that's a reflection of and you. Then, if you were sincere in your stance in that, then you should appreciate the LeBron shit. Okay. You made that possible. The shit you took is the reason why this is happening. Jay-Z walked over to Rakim and was like, yo, thank you so much, my nigga. Thank you. Thank you. I thank you. I, 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 I salute you and appreciate y'all paving the way for us. So has LeBron had that you same know, kind yeah, of... Yeah, that's not the same. That's, that's way, false way parallel. different. Way different. The parallel would be Rakim coming Rakim up to the opposite. Yeah. No, they I know. Getting, yeah. I'm saying, but Rakim embraced Jay-Z. He was happy when he seen him. That's good, he, but... He not sitting there these like niggas was kids, these niggas becoming billionaires and now. I and didn't. And yeah, when I Kareem didn't. was a kid, he had to go to school every day being attacked by about 50 white children, Correct. teenagers. Cool. Understand that. He had to go being followed and beat up almost every day of his life. Mm -hmm. He had to watch his mother get violated, his father get violated. Mm -hmm. He had to watch a lot of things that LeBron... LeBron and you Yo, should they, be they happy almost, for they that. They almost blackballed white coaches. Red Auerbach had to take a stand to even be able to coach this player. Like, how do you even work on your craft in a time where these things are going on? Which is I don't understand how the fuck y'all bring up today activism with anything that was going on what then. Flip is saying, what y'all saying is true. Got so it. if Kareem Abdul-Jabbar stood sincerely and genuinely in, I want my people to do better and be better and live better, you should be happy that LeBron doesn't have to go through the shit that you went through. 
That don't. That can be true. I'm talking to Flip's point. That but, flip just but, made. I, but I'm you should be but happy. That, but that can be true, and I not be happy that you're breaking my record because those are true, not the they, same. They're not the same thing. No, I was. Talk, I could be I was, happy about all of the true. progress you've I was made. Addressing his point that he talked about. Yeah, but now I'm on you now, nigga. We on. <laughs> yeah, I don't we run, on nigga. We on. Fuck, fuck you. Stop talking telling me about, about your man. I'm here now. What I'm saying is, even if you was happy in black progress and in the progress of the league that you helped lay the building blocks for you should be happy that somebody eventually passed your fucking record no you are arrogant bastard if you sitting there thinking oh, that your shit. shit should never be broken the fuck is you talking about whoa, whoa, okay. never be broken and being broken right now is being broken by either. a man a young man that they has asked put he, 20 years in his mind body and soul in the NBA he's picked up the torch from Michael Jordan and carried the NBA who else better to break your record than him Wait, and y'all know I'm not the biggest if, LeBron if, if fan. You're asking, I, I, if you're asking for reasons why Kareem should be upset, you're naming more reasons. You're naming more reasons that Kareem should be upset to me. You got this young guy who did this in 20 years with a three-point line. <laughs> Again, see? And that's, that's, that's where the old hating nigga part Dog, comes Dog, y'all asked me a question. I'm All I'm doing you. is... I'm but I'm, I'm not Kareem. You don't have to tell me. I, I, I'm just telling I'm you one billion nigga. reasons why Kareem... Maybe could be upset. You got the nerve to do this in a Laker uniform. You moved out here for business and to do your little movies. You've been here a good, cool three years. You won one in the bubble, which he may or may not respect. Kareem, I'm talking about. Y'all know I respect it. I came here and when... Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can see Kareem being mad. And, and, and you I can see Kareem, Kareem being an old ass hater. This franchise wasn't even about nothing when I got here. <laughs> this shit was almost bankrupt when I got here. Y'all think I'm about to sit here and clap for this bullshit? You know what you sound like? The old hating rapper nigga that hates mm. on this young, on the young yeah. nigga that came up, yo, but, got a yo, bunch but, of hits and got Yo, back. but they exist, yo. They do. But they do. They, well, only, let's call them what they only, are, only, old haters. Only on mics and on cameras and in new cool guy era do you niggas want to sit there and pretend like everybody thinks the most perfect is shit all the time. No, I'm These saying call them what they are. These niggas still on my dick are. for saying I enjoy seeing niggas fail. I do enjoy seeing niggas <laughs> oh, fail. You Guess are what? a hater. Guess what? Yes, that's everybody's it. a hater sometimes. That's it. Hey, but that's separate from, I like to see niggas win too. Yo, humans are multi-fucking faceted. Only on the internet do y'all get fixated on one fucking statement. Suck that's my me. dick. But back to Kareem. Yeah, I can see mad reasons for him to hate. I can see it. The, the same and way they, you, all, look, they all line up to the same thing. The same way you, you hold, hold up a three-point line, LeBron can say, yeah, you were seven foot in the era where you, the niggas guarding you were 6'6". Six, six. It's not true. Stop it. Stop it. LeBron can easily tell Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, nigga, you saw Bill Russell, you saw Wilt Chamberlain, you saw fucking Luke Walton. Give that's me the rest of the niggas that you saw true. on a nightly basis that was guarding you. They, they was 6'8". They, they were mad seven-footers. It wasn't Kareem mad. Played. It was a few. Every single night now on the court is niggas that's seven feet that have skills beyond anything that Kareem Abdul-Jabbar ever saw in his fucking life. So I'm not, I'm not saying that either. You, you I, I am. No, I am, though. Kareem played against Bill, and, and, and he saw Wilt. Keep going. No, it was mad I'm, of him, I'm, you said. Keep it going. It was mad, but I'm responding to your point about LeBron playing with seven-footers that had more skills than Kareem had ever seen. It's like Kareem saw Wilt. It's not true what you're You name saying. two people I on named, a nightly basis. LeBron is going up against niggas that's six foot, seven foot, that got three pointers and handles. Who? Which, you want me to name them? Tatum. He's 6'11". He handles the ball like a fucking point guard. 6'11". I don't even want to get in this argument. I want to use this. I want to use LeBron breaking these records to shit on Jordan. I don't even want to be in a Kareem. I don't even want to be in a Kareem argument with you. This don't matter that much to me. Kareem is 90 years old. Like, this don't... I'm, I, I submit. I tap out of this one. You're just laughing at Kareem as a hater. That's it. That's it. That's all That's it was. All. That's all it is was. Is he the only hater? No, no. I'm pretty sure Mike's where you, where your man. Somewhere. I ain't seen your man nowhere yet. He don't like. He don't like I ain't huh? see him say congrats. I ain't Who? see a tweet. Who? Who? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Who? I know you're not talking about Grand, Yellow Eyes. Grand Hill. Who? You talking, talking about Yellow Eyes? Yeah, you called this thing a Yellow Eyes. Yeah, eyes. Big Jeans. Yo. Big Jeans. Yeah, big yellow, jeans. yellow Eyes don't fuck with none of this big shit. Big Jeans. <laughs> we knew yeah. that when they let Yellow Eyes be the the, 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 star, the Stark Stopper. Yeah. Nah, we knew that when they let when they let dude be the um the judge on one of them dunk contests. We knew he didn't fuck with none of this. Yeah, fuck with him. Nothing was. He don't fuck with him. He don't, only I don't nigga, fuck with none of y'all. He fucks with very few niggas. Yeah, he, he don't fuck. Yeah, with he him. don't fuck. Yeah. He ain't gonna say nothing. Now, 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 that's an old hater. He a hater too. No question. That's no an difference. old hater. No, no difference. He was a young hater too. So let me ask you this now. Yeah, yeah. Me? Do do he deserve his hate? You asking me because you made me mad. What'd you say? I mean, it ain't, it ain't <laughs> gonna be the first or the last time. Yo, does he deserve his hate? Who? Yellow eyes. 
Mike? Yeah. What do you mean deserve his hate? Y'all said Kareem should stand in his hate. Should Mike stand in his hate? I think everybody, if you're going to hate, should stand in the hate. You're not answering if my you're question. Gonna... Does, is his hate warranted? No, it's not the same. I don't think it's the same as Kareem. Kareem is a Laker. Nigga. He can still hate. He he can got, still... Of course he can hate. Mike, Mike got hate to stand on. But why? He wasn't in the top three scoring anyway. Why are we talking about Mike? <laughs> why are we talking about Mike? Because every time one he day ain't one in the top four in scoring. He was at one point. He ain't. He not. And neither I will don't think he's Kareem. top five. He, why are we talking about Mike? Actually, he won't. Kareem won't. We talking be either. about the goats right now. I'm not talking about Mike. So you talking about Carl Mike Malone? Is a goat. Yeah, we talking. Mike, Mike is not a goat. <laughs> Mike, Mike is sheep. Mike is sheep. Stick talk. We, we talk about the goats. Yeah, we talking about Braun, nigga. You yeah, tell I, me about hey. fucking all these old school niggas. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy, yo. <laughs> Fuck it. Yo, like. congrats to LeBron, man. That shit was dope. It was dope watching that. I, I was that watching was the first some other basketball shit. game I watched this season. I bro. saw the little thing on the timeline. He's got 20. He only needs eight more. I said, let me LeBron go. James, regular season, second in points, fourth in assists, third in minutes, ninth in threes. I don't care about that. That's old. First and in ninth points, in yeah. steals. No, that's regular season. Mm -hmm. They oh, just split it up. Okay. They split it up. They split it up. In the playoffs, He's first in points, second in assists, first in minutes, third in threes, first in steals, first in wins. Whew. LeBron is also first in game tying or game winning shots with one minute or less to go in his career with, I think he might be tied with Kobe at eight, something crazy. Mm. LeBron, while being fourth all time in assists, has scored more than double of all of the top rest of the assist people combined. Mm. That's impressive to be top, Dog. top anything in assists and the and leading score. Yeah. That's crazy. Where's Mike on the... Uh, uh, oh, wait. LeBron is like eighth on the steals list. <laughs> He's in, man. That's the GOAT. No, what are we talking about That's here, yo? You know what the knock always what is. What are we you know talking exactly about here, yo? You know what the knock is. The guy is. is him, yo. The chips. knock is the same thing. The chips, the, the jumping from team to team. So team to team, too. That's I'm bullshit. just telling you. It's, it's not it's Jordan, because when you're Jordan comparing them to Jordan, because when you're comparing them to Jordan, that's those are the things that... Hey, look, he went, Jordan bullshit. went six for six in, Ju in the, the jumping for, you, you don't think the jumping for team Jordan team stayed with one team and got... All I mean, them rings there. I could do some. That's reading. I could do some. That's not to me. I could do some reading if you want me to do some reading. Nigga. You can read. read. You can read away. Whoa. <laughs> Name a nigga on the top fifty, a top seventy-five that Michael Jordan played with. You got two. LeBron played with like five, six. That's Name your stat. Your stats is no, trash. No, no, no. I, I got more. That's, that's all you got. It's crazy. <laughs> the top seventy-five <laughs> list. Ooh, Bruh, it's list. Give me some more stats. I'm about to. Fam. Where's that? I would, we'll wait for yeah. it. We'll wait for <laughs> it. Right there. Yeah, we'll wait right here. Yo. While you do that, Le LeBron beat the most winning team in history, yeah. and he came back from a deficit which had never been seen before. And not for nothing, he did that shit in his hometown, Yo. which was fly. Top 75 teammates. LeBron got five. Jordan got two. Seasons with two all-star teammates. LeBron got five. Jordan has zero. Top five draft picks as teammates. LeBron got 21. Michael Jordan has one. I don't care. Yeah, it was, your, your, staff, <laughs> your staff is like worthless. That don't mean How? The NBA was that different back then. Yeah, that don't mean nothing to me. It was different, bro. And you know what else? Let me throw out there. You know what else? Because I heard J.J. Reddick say it, and wow, <laughs> he's right. He is. When Mike played, the defender couldn't, it was illegal for a defender to leave their man. It's not true. It is true. It's not true. There was no zone. It is. There was no zone. You could no, double team, defense. but there was no you zone. You could not run from your man over here to the guy who has the ball over there. That was illegal. You are incorrect. No, you could double team. You can double team. There was just no zone. You couldn't play yo, zone. Yo, 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 yo. Dog, dog, I'm telling y'all something. From an NBA player, I've well researched this. Y'all should fact check it before you just refute something for the sake of doing it. You're wrong. You're wrong. I searched it. Check it. Y'all don't have to argue with me. Check it. <laughs> The fuck are y'all talking about? Check it. I'm gonna give you. It don't matter. I'm gonna give you some stats. I'm gonna give you some stats too. LeBron's the best. I'm gonna give you some stats too, which people in the Jordan Lebron debate. These are the ones that they bring up. Championships. Jordan got six. Bron got four. MVPs. Jordan got five. Bron got four. Finals MVPs. Jordan got six. Bron got four. Um, scoring titles. Jordan has ten. Bron has one. 
all defense. Jordan has nine. Bron has six. Then you go uh, all NBA. Jordan got 11. Bron got 18. All star appearances, 14. Jordan, 19. Bron. So when you start looking at that and the fact that Bron, Bron played longer uh, career wise, then you can Jordan. see it's easy. Bron is better than Mike. The only thing I with the, 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 like the easy. I'm not mad at the chip argument, but the MVP and All Star and all those are kind of political um, wins. You know what I mean? Like it's not always. Sometimes they don't give the MVP to the guy that should get the MVP because he should get it every year. You Yo, know what I'm saying? Hey, Mike included. Y'all ain't never seen nobody be this great for this long ever. Mm, okay, the well, end. Ever. <laughs> what else we got that's important over here? Uh, let's stay on sports. Brett Favre is suing Pat McAfee, yeah. Shannon Sharp. And some other nigga, I forgot. Microsoft. Disney. <laughs> that nigga suing the whole world. <laughs> that nigga suing every fucking body on the planet. Because he wanted to steal. Oh, wait, we should be careful. Yeah, yeah, wait. <laughs> Fuck him. <laughs> Easy. Fuck Brett Favre. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and anybody that love him. What, what are we thinking? What did he say? What did, sh- what did suing, Shannon Sharp say? He's suing for defamation. defamation yeah. He's suing for defamation. Okay. Suing for defamation. The people okay. called him out on his alleged oh, stealing. Oh, on the, on his, the, um, on the alleged stealing. The, the alleged stealing. Okay. Yeah, I ain't well. getting to. I'm going to say alleged. That nigga stole. <laughs> Allegedly. <laughs> Why you put it? Look, it looked like that nigga was stealing. <laughs> Yo, that nigga stole. I mean, uh, yeah. allegedly. <laughs> that shit might have happened. He might have been stealing. <laughs> I don't know. Poquito. Yeah. Oh, man. Speaking of stealing, this one hurt my heart, but it really didn't. They caught Russell Wilson skimming, skimming from the foundation. Oh man, I saw that they, too. They said he was. They got on, Russ. He was taking twenty four cents, or no? They were, no, he was, he was only giving twenty four cents on a dollar. Yeah, twenty four cents on a dollar. He was donating to the foundation, and everybody was so he, sad he and doing surprised. What everybody else does. I was getting ready to say, did it? Did it? Did the foundation say a portion of the proceeds will go there? That's Probably. What That's Absolutely. the fucking that portion. Is what I, I'm, I stand with Russ. Yeah. When you go over there and get your little extra five cent at Walmart. A portion I goes. I mean, well, Whole Foods, only a portion of that money goes there. The rest of it goes there. When you get that shit to the Red Cross, the CEO check coming out of your little spanky. Well, what they're saying is right. Also, if you happen to miss that little clause and you have a television and you watched any of the Broncos games last year, <laughs> I could have told you that he was going to start stealing from anywhere <laughs> where there was available funds. It becomes, it becomes a habit. Dog, y'all seen them games? That nigga called his people like, yo, get it all out. Go Empty the whole thing. Yo. Get all of it. Empty it, yo. Stole from the I don't know. I'm stealing I don't from them, I might as well not stop. Yeah, but yo. they might void this shit next year. I don't, right. I don't know what's going on. That nigga ain't. That was guaranteed, that's bro. guaranteed, yeah. Spanky. That nigga got... He's Who else stealing? There's some more people stealing up here. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. No, I don't see nobody else Scooter stealing Braun. right now. <laughs> Scooter Braun ain't stealing. Oh, shit. We gonna see. He ain't still. He paid Let's out. talk about it. He paid we out. We gonna see. How you think see he's what? Still? In three or four years, you're gonna let's, be like, yo, he stole. tell the people what we're talking so about. So Scooter Braun and his collective just bought uh, QC. QC's catalog for $300 million. Mm-hmm. So what I read, they said that Scooter Braun is behind or a part of the conglomerate that's just around here buying up everybody's shit. And they said a lot of it they think is related to the metaverse. Mm-hmm. And what they're going to start doing and how they're going to start flipping niggas' catalogs in virtual space. Okay. I can see it. And so I think in five, six years, we're going to say he stole. I, I find that weird for you to say that. Oh, it's business. I mean, don't give me oh, okay, oh, no, okay. no, 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 no. I'm about to say, they whatever number, that, $300 million, they felt that, hey, this is worth that I signed off on that. True. So if he turned around and turned that into three billion, well, then you you happy with your three hundred million? I'm just saying. Okay. I don't think it's stealing. I was going with the joke, but I think that they know something that's coming down the pipe mm-hmm. that everybody else is not really privy to, and that's why they buying up everybody's shit. The internet was really in an uproar about this one. Is anyone here in an uproar, or, no, or can not. explain the uproar to me? You sold your shit to a white man on Black History Month. Got it. But <laughs> once you get past that. Congratulations what? to, to yeah. P and them. To what me. is the, the black the man that made three hundred million dollars plus whatever money they made over the last seven years? Right. <laughs> That's a win. What? That's you a talking major about win? win. No. A capital W. Yeah. Man, Bold. You, you're talking to people that will take the dinner. That's true. You're right. You know what I'm saying? It's That's nice. why you can't they'll even. Find you can't, to say. They're gonna find something to say. They'll they'll take, they say they'll take the dinner. Find something to say. That's so, a huge congrats. I feel like the the internet is like in an uproar about this because the whole idea of like building a business that is like scalable and then selling it to, you know, to white interests. To someone who can buy it. Well, yeah, exactly. But not keeping anything 
within the community in order to like, you know, create, be a institutional wealth, you know, that feeds. Bro, we have seen yeah. some of these legends. Hundred million. million. We, we have I seen know, some but, of these legends, like mm -hmm. Bob Dylan and all these people selling their shit for like 400. Willie right? Nelson and all of them, right? For 50, yeah. 60 years worth of fucking work. If I'm Bob Top Dylan right now, I'm selling in my like catalog five or six or seven, I'm alive eight for about five years? more years. In five or six or seven years, whatever it's been for QC, they sold for 300? No, 300, shit. but don't forget, they the made money, right? money yeah, all of those years. That's a fucking win. You just took two street dudes, allegedly. I don't want... Throw no biology. Mm. And in seven years, we damn near at a billion dollars. They're putting in up seven years worth of work. We did. So now when you start talking about the institutional wealth, we can now take that. They can go do QC again. But now we can get into other arenas that we might not have been able to get into on a bigger scale. I don't know. I Well, you're not the guy who would have anger over this. <laughs> no. If they if somebody came to you right now, right? I don't know what you put a worth on, but I'm going to just throw a worth out and said, yo, for all of the rights to the Joe Button podcast, I'm going to give you $150 million, right? What would you do? You could, even if you took it or not, if you did take it, that 150 would open doors for Joe Button as a mogul to do way other shit, mm -hmm. way more shit. You could get into real estate development over here. You could go to Africa and open up a media company. You could do just so much shit. You got so many branches that you could just go be even way more successful and hire more black people and put on more people than you could right now. I could be wrong so too, but I didn't could, they also maintain go to Africa and do that. like they, a job? They maintain some shit, like, control. I think they still work there. They're they still their, 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 I yeah. guess, employees now. I don't know how that really works, but... That's a win. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, man. You get what I'm saying? Like, so I don't win. think I don't think that's a loss. You 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 said I would stand in that. What, what I don't think we have the information in here to to be able to call it a loss anyway. Facts. Like I think from what was announced, I mean, it sounded like a win. But you said that you 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 know I would stand on that side. I'm asking you because because like I'm because I'm trying to find out what some of the beef is, and you're not the person that can explain that to me because of people looking that you just at explained. it. People were looking at it as like a because I saw I saw. A couple people said Master P and Baby would never. Like, y'all were the next that. And to now, seven, eight years in. They say Master P is broke. They say Master P I, don't got a nickel to rub against each other. So maybe if he had done that 10, 15 years ago, he might be able to do this. I don't know. I'm you get what I'm saying? saying? Some of the arguments. They dissed Jay-Z for selling 50%. Absolutely. I, I had arguments. I'm talking about arguments with niggas for Jay-Z selling 50% of... Um, Title. No. Do say. The other one. Um, Ace of Spade. Ace of Spade to LVMH, right? Yo, that's the problem now. Black people are always selling out to the white man. Dog, if this brand, when I sold it, was worth a, a, a million dollars, let's just say a million, and these people, with their influence and with their business structure that have been set up for 50 years, could get me to over here that I couldn't do unless I put 20 years worth of work in the game, I don't got 20 years to put in. I'm gonna I'm take something that's worth a billion right here and make it worth 20 billion in the next four years. For me to get from a billion to 20 billion might have took me 30 or 40 years. That's good business. Mm -hmm. It's just good business, my nigga. Like the people be talking about the white black shit, money. I'm green. gonna I'm gonna say it sounds like good business to me because there's no more amigos. <laughs> City girls are doing whatever the fuck they're doing. Some branching branching out. don't seem like mm -hmm. music is the uh, priority there. Mm -hmm. For a lot of people, music Yachty is not getting off of that OVO jet no time soon. Mm -hmm. Cardi, so even if Cardi he might not be there, Cardi, yeah. I don't even think. I don't know. Bro. Yeah, I'm gonna get out. Yeah, That's yeah. Gene. I ain't even think about it from that, that perspective. Because I'm listening to you talk, I'm like, oh, well, maybe I keep it. Well, oh no, I'm not. I'm getting up. On, I'm getting up under this. I'm from getting this from up underneath me. Mm -hmm. um, they they on a press run. So Scooter, P, and Coach. Coach. Are they on Good Morning America? They with Ari Melba. Mm. Uh, they on Instagram. They make an announcement. So it, it is. You can tell it's important to them to get their face out there and be seen and be heard. Saying, "Hey, we not relinquishing control of our of our shit. We still there. We still working. And now we can just do it differently." So we'll see. I don't. I don't know. What to say, but we'll see. Looks Congra like besides Shouts congratulations. To congratulations. Yes. Word. Yes. Besides congratulations True. to all parties involved. And from what I hear about the boy Scooter, he certainly knows how to go get some money. I never met the guy. I, 
That's been evident. But from what I hear about him, that's been pretty evident. <laughs> By the God artist, know, he's God knows up. how to go get some money. Yeah. Hey, yeah, round up blow up again for that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, shout out to him, man. All right, who else? Who else? What else is going on oh, up Hope. here? You, you, you brought up Hope. Oh, yeah, I'm going to say you brought up Hope. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, you always and, bring up Hope. <laughs> well, hey, we all do. Stupid, yo. There's Jay. a lot of news about Hope. He's number one on the uh, top 50 uh, rappers of all time. Talk about yeah. it. Okay, on Billboard. I want to talk that about that list, we too. We absolutely have to talk about But he also won his lawsuit against um, Bacardi for $750 million. Jesus. Look, no, 750 and I still got 24% of the company Shit. still. I mean, bruh. Even with that, I, I think even in the Bacardi. No, I'm, 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 I'm guessing, but I think in the Bacardi shit, mm. I think when he did the deal with LVMH, mm -hmm. it opened up his eyes to a different person. Mm -hmm. Like your Spotify deal, and I don't want to keep throwing this back on you, but so why are you, you doing this? Because you here as an example. <laughs> Whatever you learned at Spotify. If you went and signed a deal with Apple or Amazon or Google or somebody else, the information that you now would have gotten from Google, you'll be like, yo, these Spotify niggas was doing this right or this wrong. Mm -hmm. I think him doing a deal with LVMH opened his eyes up to some of the shit that was going on in Bacardi. Like, okay. Absolutely. Oh, damn, we ain't doing like that over there? Absolutely. Oh, this how it's supposed to be done? Absolutely. Oh, let me go back oh, yeah, to yeah, 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 yeah. So this was the number that they came to, $750 million. There is They probably wanted to wrap this up so that he didn't do any more discovery. The, the more forensic shit. Exactly. Yeah. True. Because he made them niggas show all of the inventory that they had floating mm. out in stores because they gave him a low valuation, I heard. Mm -hmm. When they went to settle, they gave him a shitty valuation. Mm -hmm. He's like, nah, 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 nah. Yeah, I know. It's, what, it's worth more in the stores, that. what y'all got in the warehouses, everything. So shout to him getting another $750 million, and they said he still has um, like roughly 24% allegedly Brooklyn. Of, what he, of what they got. Brooklyn. Yeah, not Queens. <laughs> Finally got a win. I <laughs> <laughs> just lost two niggas. Fuck out of here. Shout out to Jay. Oh, man. This guy's a fool. Y'all want to do the Billboard list now? Yeah. We could definitely. So, Hove was number one on the I, list. I'll read you out the top ten. Read the top um, ten. From ten down. <clears throat> All right, so at number ten, we have Nicki Minaj. Okay. Number nine, we have Snoop Dogg. Number okay. Eight, number eight is Drake. Number seven is Lil Wayne. Number six is Notorious B.I.G. Five is Eminem. Four is Tupac. Three is Nas. Two is Kendrick Lamar. And one is Hov. And people have been up in arms left and right. I'm not going to lie. This whole list of all the greatest rapper lists that we have seen over the years is the least infuriating to me. Same. They, they weren't far off to me. They're talking to me rappers. And I know it's totally... Who? Billboard. I don't fuck with Billboard or the editor. <laughs> I know it's totally subjective, but they put you at 18. Ice Cube. Nah. How does that sit with you? Is that good or bad or what do you think about that? Billboard ain't hip hop, so their opinion don't matter. Right, right. So who gives a fuck? <laughs> so that's Ice Cube and he was like, what, number 18? Cube was 18. Okay. Apparently Ja Rule had something, something to say. He oh, was not on the list. He should have had something to say. He should have been on the list, yeah. Ja Rule? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah, he should have been, yeah. His run was too big to not be. Yeah, for, especially boy, for what yeah. they ja consider their criteria to be. Niggas. Yeah, by, judging by their criteria. If they had, by their criteria. They had yay at like 12 or something like that. It was pretty high. So if the criteria is it, it don't matter what type of hip hop you make, what type of uh, lyrical whatever, then Ja Rule should be on that list. Yeah, yay was 11. I don't, 11. See yeah, how any, I don't see how any criteria that you could come up with, Ja Rule's not in the top 50 of all time. I agree. In my opinion. Okay, well, he was he left off shit. list. Tons. So mm -hmm. he, he definitely, um, in my opinion, has some points and some validity to his argument. Was there any other massive uh, omissions? That Rakim. No, Rakim was Rakim. on Rakim was No, no, no. Top 10. He was 13. Yeah. I'm, he's in my top 10. He is in mine as well. He's in my top I can, five. I, I can see. I can, I, can see, see I, the, you, I can see the top 10 leaving him out, unfortunately, mm -hmm. where we are in hip hop. Um, because we're older. Mm -hmm. yep. Some of the, the older acts that we hold in a super duper high regard, they don't. It's kind of like Kareem. Mm. How when Kareem was number one on that, in another, let's say, 40 years or so, mm. with the way these athletes are playing, Kareem going to drop down. Yeah. He ain't going to be number two forever behind Brian either. Mm. He's going to drop. Yeah, and, and as hip hop evolves, 
the greats that we had at certain points mm. and other ones come in and do shit that has never been done, mm -hmm. they're going to drop. I'd be interested to know where Andre 3000 lands on the list. He on was, this one? Yeah. He was, I think he is. He was, and, I was like 12. If I'm he, and, 12 he, was up, yeah. he was in the top 20. He was and in the top 10 to 20. Um, Black Thought. Black Thought was 20 something, 25. Andre, Andre 3000 was 12. Okay. And you said Thought. Let me see. Black Thought was like 25, 26. Okay, so who do you think could be. Who do you think is on in the top 10? Black Thought was 28. I shouldn't be up there, but I'm eating more than half of that list. <laughs> and rap? Oh, Absolutely. Without a doubt. But again, with doubt. their criteria, I shouldn't it's not, be. I, it's I not started with rap. I shouldn't be up yeah, there. It's not, I shouldn't just, be up it's there. not just your I understand ability that. to rap. Mm -hmm. I understand that. They didn't just count that. Right. I'm not they sitting here saying, put the mixtape rappers in there. <laughs> Stop. Well, don't worry. <laughs> Who's on the list that you think should not have been on the list? Like maybe in like the top 20. Um, they all deserve to be there. Yeah, there wasn't really. Okay. It wasn't. Crazy. I think some of the numbers were the, was a little off. Like when you got Jada and you got certain Red Man and them in the forty six number. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. But everybody up there deserved to be up there. Okay, so question is: Snoop, Should Snoop be number nine? He should be top ten. Nigga, no. Yeah. Going by their criteria. Yes, by their should. criteria. What's yeah. the cri What's the criteria? Because we um, always, whenever no, we do Snoop these is, lists, we always talk about the the criteria. So. Snoop is probably arguably the. All right, here it is. Biggest <clears throat> rapper in rap history. Dog, Billboard will not get me to argue about. Gotcha. I know who belong where in my head. So this is the criteria. <laughs> okay. The teams took into account the following criteria. The not teams. In any particular, they had, they had, Fuck them teams. The teams. Well, it was Billboard and Vibe, right? Yeah. yeah. Not, not, not in any, not in any is, particular order. Ooh, so many pros. <laughs> so many professional only... ears in the room. Yeah. It was body of work slash achievements. Mm -hmm. So you try to singles, albums, certifications, mm. cultural impact slash influence, longevity, lyrics, and flow. Once you add all of that in there, it kind of changes things a little bit. Okay, but wait, some wait, players wait. have I'm some players, some rappers have a very high, it's like in 2K in sliders. Mm -hmm. Your slider is all the way up in lyrics mm -hmm. and flow, but Longevity might be low and cultural, cultural impact, impact might, might be, be low, low and uh, body of work and achievements might be low. Okay. What do they consider to be longevity? I longevity, asked, longevity. And I asked that because both Tupac and Biggie, they died very young. So we got okay. a certain catalog from them, but their number, what, five and three? But also cultural oh, impact and influence. Okay. Mm -hmm. This is an average out. Okay. So like I said, longevity could be low. Mm -hmm. Longevity says years at the mic. That's yeah. what it says here. But their impact, Tupac's impact and influence is undeniable. Got it. Yo, it is 2023, yo. <laughs> <laughs> what you, what, what no you say? No Tupac's landing, Joe. <laughs> not Joe. <laughs> too far. I'm not Stop. slandering nobody. Yo, but. Joe's chill. It's cultural <laughs> impact is huge. <laughs> Tupac's <laughs> impact. All right, nigga. Snoop's cultural <laughs> impact is huge. Yeah. So Snoop's longevity got 30 years in hip-hop. Mm -hmm. And his cultural impact is bar none. Top three, you got to put them in there using so, that criteria. Are yeah. you guys putting Nas before Tupac and Biggie? Personally, yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. Come on. Because on my list, I'm gonna tell you on my when I do my list, mm. certain shit weighs heavier than others. Just me. Mm -hmm. What? What? I don't, I don't Yo, know. What's what's happening? Happening? Got going on. <laughs> hey, give us, give us your take, bro. He has a, he what's has a bullet then? with a name gave, on it. I gave my take twenty minutes ago, which was I will not let Billboard make me argue about who belongs where, and then I, that's what my take. That's it. So you have nothing else to say about it? About this particular list? Yes. No. Okay. And you acknowledge that there's no Tupac slander. That Tupac deserves to be there. Yes. I don't slander Tupac. Do he deserve to be on the list, top four? Of course. What are you talking about? Okay. Of course. I want to make sure Look I'm at sure. you fishing for something. <laughs> I just want to make sure you're fishing for something. You already on niggas' radar. Fuck is like his favorite rapper. Who radar? What is favorite rapper? Fuck all them niggas. Hey, oh. whoever I'm on their radar, fuck them niggas. I don't fuck with y'all niggas. Leave it there. Niggas add you with the albums. Stop. Who added me with the album? What are you talking about? Come on, man. You just said it earlier, man. The album? You be fit. I'm not. You ain't going to get me again. That's Young boy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Because of Ice. It's got me in fucking ice. trouble with the Young Boy squad. Yeah. It's not because of ice, man. Nah, you can't put that on me. Why not? That was you. Stop it, yo. That was you came in here talking about the NBA Young Boys chain, which forced me to say that I don't believe him. <laughs> you, you actually intro the topic and said, let's argue about NBA Young Boy. 
That's what happened. Don't tell people how the, the meat, is, meat is made. Pause. No, he said it on the fucking mic. Yo, let's argue about him being a young boy. Okay. Let's argue. Liam Young niggas. I wouldn't have had to argue my position that way. Anyway. If, if we had agreed with you? No, yeah, I ain't got believe uh, agree with me. I just didn't know. He tried to stick his fans on me. Don't do that, man. Chill oh, out. Oh, man. Chill out. Because I fuck with that guy. Being a podcaster is hard. Because you can fuck with somebody, but say something to where it sounds like you don't fuck with them. I get it. Or you could fuck with somebody on I 80% get of their shit, and that 20% you don't really agree with. Yeah. And, well, they'll, and they'll tear your fucking head off for you, the 20%. You could fuck with somebody, and they not know it. That's why. Like, a lot of, like, have you and Youngboy had a conversation? No. No, right? So he might not know that Joe fucks with him. Now, the one thing you say that might come off as negative, people are going to start grabbing it, tagging him, showing him. True. So now, this is my but introduction I've said, man, to Joe positive speaking. things about him. They don't show I that. I know they don't show that. I don't know. I know. The negativity is I what... Know. Rick gains legs. Let's get down to brass tacks, man. What's up? What? You think Drake has something to do with the XXX shit? <laughs> no. They grasp me a straw, right? Like, yeah, but I mean... <laughs> you next, man. I came in get here and I laughed. Hey, first of all, round of applause. Now that Max B lawyer is not the worst lawyer to ever take uh, defend somebody <laughs> at a trial. Because, man, this guy in that triple X case, that guy is a doof doof. Yeah. Wor worse than... Um, he is wait. a doof. Doofy, doof, doof. Tory lawyer. Oh, yeah, that's another one. No, nah, this guy got him beat. Oh, all right. This guy got him beat. If you're listening to what, what he been up there saying, he's a mess. But anyway, I came in here and clowned the guy <laughs> because I thought no way in the world would anyone believe this bullshit about Drake having something to do with X being murdered. But law is the law. So now they want Drake to come in and either take the stand or provide a, uh, a despo uh, deposition. 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 That is some bullshit. That and if he does it, what happens? Well, you got to be you penalized if you don't. You, you get a warrant. Yeah. yeah. You, you, you have get to. get arrested. And now we got to listen. A subpoena. Is, it, is, now, is court ordered? Subpoena. Yeah. Now we got to oh. listen to Drake talk about how he's on trial for murder. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Honestly. Yo, it's for be, the next 10 years. Yeah, I'm the golden man. child, so they oh put me on God. trial. Oh, oh I'm talking about oh. 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 oh, Hold up, man. <laughs> I didn't think we was going to get an ish rap today. They got him. Yeah, I don't want to hear Drake talking about they put me on the stand and I stood tall. I don't want to hear it. At all. I, it's coming, though. <laughs> it's coming. That's Party all. Party going to start crooning. <laughs> 40 put a little underwater on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear none of that. At but all. this is going to be bad. It's hilarious. See, y'all playing, and this is funny. I'm not about to make it serious. But? But this is spook. It's spooky. It's spooky. We should have known this. When the judge in Philly was trying to make Meek Mill do the Boys to Men song, <laughs> nobody was screaming. Now, this is, this is more weird shit. The people that make the laws and the verdicts and pick the juries can't be groupies, yo. Uh, mm. They're groupies. I think you can at least understand trolling. You want Drake to come in here because he's Drake and you want to see how Drake smell and see how he look and get in, take a couple pictures. Uh, nah, he know what happened. Drake coming there, all TMZ and everybody <laughs> else. Not saying it wouldn't already be a media circus, oh, but now Drake they, being here. They be clout chasing too much, yo. And, and what make this worse is they got all the evidence that they could ever need in this particular case. Yeah, right. They keep releasing videos. And I'm like, oh, We shit, got the oh. people that was in, did the robbery, people that was in the car, uh -huh. the guy that left the car. We got everywhere that he went. We got the videotape of this, videotape of that. We have a confession of this. <laughs> they don't need Drake. At all. <laughs> what city is it in? Somewhere in Florida. Somewhere, Somewhere in Florida. Florida. Yeah. Gotcha. So aren't they talking about getting, giving you a subpoena? You're next, buddy. You're next. <laughs> but I ain't nobody. So they shouldn't really well, want to um, see. I well, the don't problem know. is, is the problem is they're just clearly pulling shit from the internet. So you probably said something at some point Yo, on the internet, I, and now that now you're I'm in telling it, you, uh, it's going to be coe. <laughs> it's going to be coe. Word it's going to be put, put the super fly music on. I'm getting my chinchilla. You got to bring some flip. platform boots. <laughs> bring flip. Bring huh? flip. I'm bringing my girl with a titty. It's going to be crazy. <laughs> it's going to be a movie. Play with me. <laughs> it's going to be a movie when Joe. Oh, we, we, we think Joe Button just pulled up. Nah, Joe. <laughs> oh, no, I need flip the background. It's the network. It's the network. It's the network. <laughs> it's the network. <laughs> I need Yo, get real theme music. Like has some instruments play. Real theme music. Have them niggas follow oh, we can bring follow the band. And y'all thought y'all thought Drake was about to be bad with the take the stand shit. <laughs> <laughs> wait till I wait till they get a load of me. <laughs> I told you I'm not telling the truth. I'm gonna put some sauce on. 
<laughs> yeah, me and the little nigga did have an issue. <laughs> what? You got me down. I man. didn't like him. What? What's up? Yeah. Uh, Look. I know. <laughs> what? What are they gonna do? He can say whatever he wants as long as he doesn't perjure himself. Fam, that judge said, "Yo, I'll find you in contempt. Give this guy he want. He want be a smart aleck thirty days." Sounds like a vacation to me. Let's go. Yes, you think I ain't never did thirty days in jail? <laughs> Cause I didn't. Not 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 <laughs> not, 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 not in you not, today. Not in no, a no, state no, no. jail where you don't know nobody. No 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 no. In any jail. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> no no. I bail out way before I get the gin pop. I'd be it, surprised it, I get the no, gin pop. Don't bail out when the judge. They be like Joe, come this what way. I'm like, I'm on gin pop. <laughs> my mommy. <laughs> <laughs> my people, my people out there, yeah. They ain't come up there. Yeah, they up there check and see if my people is out there. You sure? We can get the free Joe, free Joe yeah. merch popping. Word. Come on, man. We out of here. <laughs> Yo, out when here. I when I hit Jim Pop, I, I, I still wasn't over there for about thirty minutes. I ain't even spend the night in there. But when the security guard came back, he talking about <laughs> get your shit, you out of here, right? So you got to <laughs> carry your bed and your pillows, all your shoes. <laughs> them niggas that was in there. <laughs> Yo, dog, let me get that pillow. Nigga. <laughs> Yo, let me get that. <laughs> Yard set, whatever. Whatever you want. Word. No Girl, yeah, you yeah, can have it all Toilet for me. Toilet tissue. You can Actually, have whatever you like. A dude just came under fire for that on um on the internet because he, he got out. Well, you know. <laughs> look at him now. That's what they call that shit. No, 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 you said it, though. That's what they call but that shit. But I said but under fire. Ice and fire don't on. mix. <laughs> hey, look at it. It farts. I want to go home <laughs> because he he was getting out and had all his like ramen noodles and all his shit and took everything with him. And they was like, "Yo, dog, that's some sucker shit." That's some yeah. That's yo, you a sucker. You supposed to get that that's to the homies, yo. Shit, yo. He had, but he had mad shit. They was a fucking with him in there probably. Oh, he had mad shit. And, and I don't know if all I all the way agree with that one though. What if he didn't have nothing? What if he didn't have nothing? Uh, on the outside, when, yeah. When he was going home, mm. I think this person did though. They ate for a dollar, my nigga. It's slightly, dog. it's a little petty. Get out to the homies in the, in the bing, man. That's what was happening. Everybody's like, yo, come on, dog. You can't do that. Yo, you got to get out yo, to the homies. Yo, you know Can you we tell stories honey, about when you was in the hood and some nigga that just came home and fell on bad times, ran up on you, started telling you about it, and you didn't care? <laughs> you ain't tell him that. I bet you ain't tell him that. <laughs> yeah, how you got out the conversation? I, I bet you ain't tell him that. Yeah, you said I right asked y'all. Like, I didn't ask y'all for y'all to ask me. <laughs> no, nigga, uh, it happened what, to what all was of the us. outcome for you first? <laughs> nah, I cared. I cared too. I, I cared. I cared. I cared as well. I cared. It, it. I definitely cared. I was like, wait, for real? For real, dog? How much you gave him? <laughs> <laughs> how much you gave him? <laughs> A lot of love. <laughs> a lot of love. You be lying. You be giving it. I do. I remember that. I do. I, I only pretend to be a real piece of shit on here for content's sake, but I give plenty of niggas money that came out of jail. She getting five thousand ten. Yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. What? what you need, LLC? <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what you, what, you opening the car wash? Yeah, he wow. Five or five thousand. You, you, you want me to front the barbershop? I give niggas some money on my pocket. I ain't going to the bank for the nigga. How much you gave? Oh, nah. Nah, I want to know. You. He not your man. You're not talking about your man. You're talking about the random nigga. Just yeah, came home. Okay, give it. you their whole life story. While you sit there, they got their little bag. I may give him like a 200. Depending on what I got on me. Oh, shit. And I speaking of jail. About 50 speaking of jail. <laughs> Take his 50. Inmates harvesting organs for an early release date. That's disgusting. That is some bullshit. I'll is let you know it why? really disgusting? Oh, please. Is it disgusting? Bitches is getting their ribs removed for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas <laughs> trying to come home, man. And telling is, is not... Hey, Flip, do you, did, you, did you read it or you didn't read it? No, I didn't, but I... You know I what the it. max is? What? That they take off your shit? Uh, no, tell me. A year. Oh, no, no, no. I'm not giving a nigga my lung for a year. Nah. nah. Hold on now. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Nah. They're harvesting Limit. organs and doing what? Giving where are they for, going? For uh, um, donors, like donors, you, you're, yeah. being, you're being a voluntary donor for transplants and shit like that. And so, if you give <laughs> one of your organs out, they'll uh, they'll knock a year off. They'll knock some time off your sentence. Can I combine this? Like Not I can for, give you a lung and a kidney, and that turns into two. So you gonna get a? You're whole gonna get out just to fucking die. I'm just asking a question. Okay, just. But what if I got a year left? 
And your our, your I organs are probably shit. Really, no, 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 freeze, chill. Mm-hmm. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm asking a question, y'all. If you got a year left, nigga, I'm gonna rock out with this last year. I've been in here already. I'm gonna go home healthy. And the lungs. What if I got sentenced to a year and don't want to do a year? You. I ain't doing it. Yo. <laughs> are you asking your questions? Yo, did you, did you, ask you, you, question? did you exhaust your snitching, your snitching call? <laughs> huh? Did you exhaust all snitching options? I'm asking you. Yeah, not, uh, none of the snitching worked. Everybody okay. I tried to give y'all, y'all already knew <laughs> we, this ain't gonna help. <laughs> if you okay. too scared to go to jail, you gonna give up your lung or your kid? I didn't see, who said about scared? I said, I don't wanna go. <laughs> I didn't say about scared. I don't wanna go. I like freedom. I love this shit. Man. Well, you met this, nigga. this shit is amazing. <laughs> I like breathing, my nigga. I, I like it. I said ain't gotta lung. be a lung. I'm just giving it. Yo, the rap game fucked up today. I can't get a feature from one of my favorite rappers because I told him somebody. <laughs> that don't make <laughs> no <laughs> sense to me. What? Oh. That don't make no sense to me, yo. Oh, that guy. It don't. I'm sorry. You bugging. I'm calling a spade a spade. You bugging. That don't make no sense to me. You bugging. You niggas got honor everywhere, but where y'all supposed to have it at? <laughs> well. <laughs> Hey, what's the dude's name? He wanted right. well, He wanted two fifty. Yeah, from Gunner. Bando Kev. Mm-hmm. That's Ice Man, right? Yeah. Not my man. Bam Man Kevo. Bam Man Kevo <laughs> said he gave Gunner two fifty for a verse. Gunner went to jail, ratted, and came home. And this nigga wants his money back. No. <laughs> he no. doesn't get his money back. <laughs> no, nigga. <laughs> it was, I, was it a no snitching clause in this in this agreement on this verse? You. I will want my money back too. You can want it. I, I don't know if I would get it. Back. <laughs> See that don't or make no sense. Legally be entitled to get it back, but I will want my money. Wait, back. wait, hold on. How, why would you? Why you want your money back? What? Well, I, I don't answer. I, mean, I don't I want the, the verse no more. I know the answer. I don't that. want the verse no more. But hold on. So you not getting buyer's money remorse, back. nigga? Yeah, you would. You might not get your money back. You're not getting your money back. I wouldn't be mad at him if he didn't get my money back, but I would really. But he didn't fulfill the obligation. I would get mad at you for even asking me for the money back. Now I might give you the verse. How the verse of the shit? Now you now you get a a whack verse. Yeah, yeah. (laughs) (laughs) Nigga don't even talk about nothing but (laughs) shit. Now you get a verse about rat about me ratting. (laughs) What you saw, I told. (laughs) (laughs) I kept the streets clean. The fuck these beats mean? (laughs) Yeah, I'm getting. Yeah, (laughs) that's it. Word. Yo, nah, oh, that's shit. more than 16, too. 24 bars about me ratting. <laughs> Cheese eater. You gave me 250. Let me throw an extra eight on him. <laughs> and, and give you a little bridge. The rap no, game no. is twisted, yo. Yeah, no, no way. Okay, Look, qu- we doing all that, and Sam Smith and them just get to go out. <laughs> 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 yo, we are crazy. Damn, I'm not over that Sam Smith shit either, by the way. Yo, don't start it. Please, Patreon, just leave it alone. <laughs> leave, leave that alone. Come they, on. They now. killed him? It's just too much. It, it's they can't kill me. So it's about, it's I about, about, I'm not scared. It's about agendas and stuff like that. They can't, been on Patreon they can't kill me. I was spitting facts. I was spitting facts. I agree with him. I'm too much of a friend of the community. You, I'm not never going to say something that should be offensive to that community. I love the community. Okay. But I'm not, I wasn't having to talk about the community. Uh-uh. I was having to talk about music. Uh-huh. And, That's the problem. Yeah, exploitation. That's the problem. When you can't even have a music talk without getting into who's fucking who, who identifies what, who was comfortable as a child, who come from a two parent household. Nigga, do y'all got slaps? <laughs> <laughs> Where are the slaps? Is all. Very different from the P Valley shit. The P Valley, that whole uproar in the conversation, right? The writers wrote the show, yo. Mm-hmm. The writers are writing this show for the show to be what it is. If you don't want to watch that, then nigga, don't watch it. Turn you it don't. Off. You yeah, don't watch true. it. True. That's it. The Grammys is for music celebration. These are not writers, but no, they are. There's writers, <laughs> but 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 there are, and that's where you got to have a conversation. Fuck out of here, Sam Smith. Yeah, that perform- performance is od. Okay, I missed the Grammy conversation, okay? Aww. I missed it. However. No, it no, missed no, no, you. I know, but there's still more stuff. Okay, so Beyonce lost album of the year mm. and is like a big controversy online because there is um, members of the Academy voting body who mm. are saying, they're basically anonymously saying why they don't vote for Beyonce. And it has nothing to do with her talent, has nothing to do with the impact of the album it has nothing to do it's literally she's too popular Damn. or there's there's too much fanfare when and whenever her albums drop so who's, it kind of like takes away from it they won't n- no names revealed it's anonymous it's Kareem. Hmm? it's Kareem 
Kareem. Old ass haters. Old ass haters. Yeah, that's all I told you. Old ass haters. Yeah. yeah. Jay Z just came out and said that he feels like the board may have missed the moment mm. as far as not giving her album of the year. That's yeah. a good husband. I, I am, but yeah, I agree. He's, he's right. we, we said that before. He said that. Yeah. Yeah. He, he watched the pod. Yeah. Let me ask you this. I kind of stand on the other side of that. What? Why do we have to give her album of the year for the moment? If, if we felt as though she didn't deserve it. That's the point. The Why po- is it a moment? Everything in this culture is about catching and capturing the moment. Well, life is a series of moments. Mm-hmm. Moments mm-hmm. pass. Mm-hmm. Then moments pass. That one is yeah. gone. Get over it. <laughs> if they well, felt as though her album wasn't well they, it. Well, they saying it's not. They saying it's not gone. And when you talk about moments, right, in hip hop. It ain't going at all. Man. Yeah, in hip hop. We used to be able to quantify shit by hit records. Today, it's moments. And that Beyonce shit... Would have been a moment. No, no, no. Is. is. Yeah. Dog, let me tell you, Ish. I've seen videos. They played that out. They were, they were having literally club renaissance parties across the country where they just played the album. Mm. I ain't seen that with nobody else's album. Yeah. I, I I'm not talking about album cuts. I mean track one through the end. Everybody, this is the party. Everybody at the Grammys j- tried to dress like Beyonce. I, and what I'm saying is I'm not knocking that. I'm saying that if the voting body felt as though she didn't win, Mm-mm. right? Uh-huh. Why did they do a disservice by not voting for her because they didn't catch that moment? It would have been a record. Uh, no, the, no, the, no, no, no. Here's the, the thing. The most of all time and no, all that no, no. other so shit. So here's the thing. The particular members that have been, um, that have been interviewed, they've been around for a while. Beyonce has been up for album of the year four times and she's lost four times. She never wins in like the major categories. And they're saying that that is basically an implicit, implicit bias that they're basically, you know, judging from gotcha. rather than recognizing the impact, the talent, the forget the fact that she's Beyonce. And did she deliver a product that had a global impact? Yes, she did. Both times with Lemonade and Lemonade Renaissance. And Beyonce album. True. Yeah, exactly. I won't, I won't argue against it when y'all are telling me Bonnie Raitt is album of the year. Like, oh, she was, was song that, of the what, year. What and I had to go listen to the, the song. I was what was like, the album of the year? Uh, Harry Styles. Harry yeah. Styles. Oh, Harry's house. Oh, yeah. He was shocked. He won. Stop it. Yeah. He had one song. It. it was a massive song, but it's just like, I can't think of anything off the album other than that one song that was like a TikTok phenomenon. Ba- whatever. Basically, I hear the look, basically, like basically what it sounded like the, the Grammy members were saying, it don't matter what Beyonce dropped. It doesn't matter what she does. It doesn't it matter. matter. Yeah. Well, I don't care what this album sounds like. It could be amazing. Any, you're not getting album of the year because you're just too popular and your fans is just a, too much of a it's big the, deal. The argument is the same argument that niggas make. If you really want to be keeping it You know it what, book, though? Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. If you really want to keep it a buck, based on certain shit, LeBron will have seven MVPs. They can't just come out every single year and give LeBron James the MVP. But they can give him one. Yeah. <laughs> Four. You get what she I'm saying? Ain't got like, one. She I'm, ain't got one. She has the most Grammys in history. We talk about the, the, the album of the year. Grammy. I understand. I'm just giving Not you an example of mm-hmm. like, yo, they're saying like, yo, she's too popular. We can't just have her come and just no. But li- but the but the but the kicker is is that Taylor Swift has won it three times. That is true. And she's been up That's against true. Beyonce, That's true. and she's won it three times. So if yeah. we're gonna talk about a, I stand corrected. Yeah, if we're gonna talk about a massive fan base, That's true. The, Swifties the Swifties have Swifties proven. Well, no, no, no. I'm pretty sure Harry they Styles got a big fan base too. He, he does. does. He does. But going up against Beyonce and Kendrick Lamar. Anybody that's not a Harry Styles fan can't name you three other songs exactly. on, on this project. True. Exactly. But his fan it's, base is probably crazy watermelon, overseas and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, they'll save. I don't give a fuck about none of that One Direction <laughs> shit. Let me. I'm just be honest. All that shit that they be hyping up. Oh, he came from the group. Now look what he. I don't give a fuck about One Direction, that direction, next direction. None of it. <laughs> His young ass will be here, and he seems like a people fan and Grammy favorite. He'll be here. It's the same thing I just said about Jalen Hurts. Let Harry Styles' ass show up and show up and show up again and exactly. prove that, yo, I'm Harry Styles, mm-hmm. and I got one here. Mm-hmm. And then I'm with you. Beyonce been here since niggas was 17 years old, yo. Mm-hmm. Give the girl a fucking award. And consistent and deliver. Those Lemonade and Renaissance. Now I'm sitting here saying give nah, Renaissance. Yeah. Look, like, look, look, now. Yeah, I'm, come yeah, on, yo. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you, look, I, y'all, y'all swayed me. Sometimes I think Hove talk just because he a husband. But in other cases... Nigga be valid. This is yeah, all sure. the way valid. Because he, he didn't bash them either. He said, I feel like they missed the moment. Mm-hmm. 
which was that was the moment where she should have gotten it. Mm-hmm. And if I was dumb, I can't speak for that because that's above my pay grade. But I wouldn't have came. Hmm. I wouldn't have came. Well, they're probably the way that y'all. Hey, y'all need Beyonce and Jay Z here a little more than you need Harry Styles here. True. So and again on the phone, the tell most... me which award it is. Don't tell me I'm breaking the record. All right, I got to come because I'm breaking the record. But nah, I don't know. No, I think they might have sold it like that, though. Like, yo, you know you're going to break the record this time. So you would assume if you're her, I'm going to break it for album of the year. I'm, I'm up there. Bells and whistles on. I'm, I'm in the building. And either way, you're breaking the record. You probably want to show up. True. But I'm, I'm showing up. The for most Grammys I'm ever. Show, I'm showing fam, up. I'm if showing I know up, that I want Beyonce's the one not now. winning the main award, yeah. and I know that Khaled is about to go 0 for 6, then I might stay home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because y'all got a god, a god did performance out of me. Because this is my artist, and I'm here repping. Y'all kept the camera in my face the entire night. Fam, it was so bad that Trevor Noah had to remind the crowd, "Yo, she is coming." She's no, coming. I'm talking about Jay too. Because again, when you get one, you get them both. So you 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 hitting all the buttons. You checking all the boxes. Like mm-hmm. we checking the whole urban black feminist everything category. We gonna have both of them here. Jay Z. Jay Z in the uh, audience. I was mad. For, I was mad for Khaled after I learned that he was nominated six times and went over six. And y'all know I don't normally be mad for Khaled. But yeah, I was same, mad there too. Same. I was a little. I was a little. Cause that's shady. That's a little. They, they played in niggas' faces. Just stop it. And, it, played, and it, worked. And it, worked. it worked. And it worked. It worked. And it worked. Like, Khaled just got a new gig, right? He's a Def Jam. Part, partner of Def Jam. Def Jam, he brought his We The Best imprint to Def Jam. Let me hit the round of applause. Also, he is the global... Creative consultant. Global, global creative. creative consultant for Universal. Hey, yo, how you get one of them seven-figure jobs with a fancy title? Who said that that's a seven-figure job? We don't know. <laughs> I was asking you. Oh, I don't know. They oh, won't give me one. Oh, you're creative. <laughs> They're going to give me one of those important jobs when I'm 50 years old. That's true. Like, when I'm done with the debacle, what's the word? Debauchery? Debauchery. 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 When I'm done just with this just buffoonery. <laughs> I agree with that. They don't, the trust levels are not there yet. For them. Mm-hmm. He might go wild out in the pod, yeah. Yeah. Chairman. They talk to me about the job. Chairman They'll call and be like, yo, we, your name came up for, like, I know, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> sure, yeah, don't, don't worry about it. Uh, but congratulations to Khaled. Yeah, that's dope. Yeah. Uh, apparently, the, Lucian's fingerprints are all over this. I listened to the... The announcement. How did Khaled become unsigned? It's a very good question. Shit might have expired. Yeah, but how do you let that? No, 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 no. They don't just let it expire. There's something going on that yeah, I don't yeah. know about. Name, they don't let. They don't let it. If it's your Khaled last album coming never up, got unsigned. If it's your last album coming up, we not dropping this until you resign. I'm sure he probably wanted an executive position and was not going to resign until you give me some type of executive position. Because uh-huh. he's been an executive before, right? Wasn't he at uh, Def Jam before? Yes, but I don't know about the executive part. He was behaving like an executive. Yeah. But when he wanted the, the, the big dog job, they wouldn't give it to him. He's basically like his, even as an artist, he's an executive. executive. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So it makes all sure. the sense in the world for sure. him to be that officially somewhere. He got relationships all over the place. Yeah. And then y'all gonna make Ace Hood pull his dreads out. That's <laughs> 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 stupid, yo. Joe, man. <laughs> 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 Y'all don't want to pop for me. Nope. <laughs> <I hate>. nope. <laughs> Y'all gonna make my nigga uh, <laughs> start the Bugatti up. <laughs> <laughs> All she gotta do is be able to pop her that head. She hard. gonna get some money out of Crazy. me on that. that as soon as the beat drop. What? Right there. Sheesh. Oh, so you will give some money to the young ladies. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. So yeah, you come in here and be lying. No, he's I, 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 I've never lied about that. A couple hundred. To certain, to certain records. To certain records, right? Yeah. Okay. Let that March Madness drop on. Anytime I hear March Madness, I might empty my Flip, you throw money? No. No. I used to, but not no more. Oh, okay. You retired? Yeah. At an early age. <laughs> you got up out of there. Yeah, nah. I'm I was falling you. in love with them bitches too much. All right, yeah. <laughs> I was. I wanted to hit Raw and all that. I was, I was violent. <laughs> Wait, what? that means love. Wait, I'm, I'm <laughs> wait a minute. We gotta, redo, gotta redo some shit now. For a minute, like, it's love. Yeah, it's love for a minute. You're in the wrong room, my nigga. No, I'm just being honest. I, I'm, I'm with you. I throw money, I start my mind. <laughs> I'm on telling me no. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Love, you trying try to save her? her? No, no, no. I love her. You be trying to save her? <laughs> what? 
Like, you ain't got to do this no more. <laughs> what? Do I? Did I? I was whack. I was worse than that nigga. too good for this girl. <laughs> I was worse from, from Strippy Combs over there. Strippy Combs. I was worse than him. <laughs> strippy Combs. Saving. King Strips. I was worse than that nigga. I ain't been to the strip club. <laughs> In like a week? Longer than that. Two. Longer than I that. I feel like you were it's going two, like, like it's two weeks, bro. Maybe like two. yeah. No, it's been be like, I'm telling you, it's been longer than bro, two weeks. Bro, we know when you went because you told us. So we out today. What we doing? Parks, get out of here. I was here. gonna say, Parks, you're <laughs> in bad well, English right club? now. You still go to the strip club? Hmm? What you mean, Parks? Yeah, I figured it out. I don't necessarily need the strip club. I just need two outing. I need one dinner outing and bowling. That bowling on Monday will will change the rest of your week. By the way, too at, at you know forty plus. Is, Joe? You, oh, found, you, you, found, you found something else. Yeah, that's what you did. That's yeah. it. You got to do what something. What did I find? The bowling. The bowling ball. You throwing the bowling ball yeah, instead of throwing the money. It. Well, I typically would agree with you, but I'm not smoking, so I shouldn't be just sitting around home idly. No, I'm just saying. That's, a, yeah. that's when I know I'm gonna sit there and get my get my smoke on. <laughs> even prior, even prior to that, like. <laughs> As soon as you find something <laughs> you that you like, pad. you in uh, it. Got a new pad? A new pad? What do you mean? You home right? No. No? I ain't doing shit. My sleep schedule has changed. I don't watch every show there is in the world. <laughs> but more importantly, no smoking. I ain't smoking. Good for you. No man. smoking, man. Good, man. Hold up. no good for you. Shut it up. <laughs> Nigga, I'm trying to congratulate you. Word. Congratulations. I was talking to Park. I don't want to hear nothing from no smokers. <laughs> I don't even talk to smokers. He <laughs> <laughs> phony as hell. It's like me when I, I got the lace. I I'm phony. You can't see? Nah, this, this non-smoking shit, I got three to four days up under my belt. Let me tell you, man, I want to yell at one of y'all for not telling me. So, this breathing thing, <laughs> it's not the worst thing, yo. It feels good, right? <sighs> mm -hmm. Look at that. Mm. Now I want to take that little test that made me feel all insecure. <laughs> That little test. To blow, we gotta, blow the shit up? Yeah, blow the yeah. ball as high as you can blow it. Get a yeah. couple more days, yo. Mm. Oh, no, I'm, I'm going. I'm going. I'm no, chilling. I'm saying you're going there two weeks off the, the no As smoke. a smoker, you were trying to blow that Let little ball? Let me add it, nigga. Yes, it wasn't budging. <laughs> <laughs> that little ball was not going nowhere. You start choking and shit. <laughs> really? <laughs> nigga, what? Trying to get that ball to the top of the thing? That's how they know how bad you are. That's crazy. You never tried that? Never had to try that? Well, he's never smoked, smoke. drank, smoke. taken... Pills, Eat pork. Have raw sex. Pork. <laughs> like he is he a special a, specimen. He has children. Stop. He's a special specimen. But how did he get him? <laughs> oh, that lab. That's what that I'm lab saying. Was the little light skin lab. Yeah. That lab. Yeah. <laughs> the little light skin lab. <laughs> the lab you was telling us. The little light skin lab that exists. Yeah, from the PO box. Next thing we got oh, PO boxes. <laughs> Put a little cup in there. Uh, it's kind of stupid. Yo. Let's see. What else? What else? What else? Are you about Glorilla? Yo, dog. What happened? I'm going to start telling the truth. Okay, what happened with Glorilla? All right, so she had a hosting out in, um, well, well, well. <laughs> stop there. She got booked. She got, there we go. She got booked out in Oakland. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, flyer goes out, says, Glorilla performing live. Mm -hmm. She shows up. That's already a problem, by the way. Depending on whose side you believe in this. Okay. Uh, she shows up. She doesn't perform. Uh-huh. It's a hosting, you said. No, I said she got booked. We corrected that. Oh, okay. She said she, um, no, she didn't perform. So upon leaving out, fan throws a, uh, some water or a drink or something on her and going off on her. Oh, that's fine. Bum ass shit, you know, shit like that. So the, the issue came with her saying she wasn't paid for a performance. Mm. And they saying her performance rate is 30K. Okay. But then the promoter put a video out saying, Nah, dogs, I paid 30K. No, you're saying, uh, they said her performance rate was way higher than 30K. Was higher than 30K? Yes. Uh, okay, excuse me. <laughs> they said her performance rate is 50K. Okay. And they gave her 30K for the walkthrough. That's where the discrepancy comes. Got it. And the promoter saying he the gave promoter 30K saying, under the impression she I gave 30K and expressed, I need a song. And y'all told me that I was getting a song. And it wasn't just me. Y'all were shopping this around the town. Yeah. So it's a few mm. promoters that you hit saying, I got 30, uh, we need 30, we'll pop up for a song. And we'll do a song, one song. Okay. They threw water on her. Yeah, they threw some water. water. They threw some water song. on her, right? Yo Gotti, my man, salute to Yo Gotti. Love Yo Gotti. Tweets or leaves, leaves a comment and says, 30, they must, 30 grand for performance. They must be talking about Lil Glow. Not Big Glow. Not Big Glow. <laughs> 
Nigga. Yes, Jay's Come on, who want to jump in? Price. Who want to jump in? Because I don't want to tell the truth about shit. Nah, you got to tell the truth. Stop doing that. Stop leaving it on us. Then you're like, oh, y'all not talking. Go ahead. Tell us. So on you, Captain. No, and this one is a little different. I can't tell the truth because the parties involved might not even know the truth. <laughs> that, Why do, it's up to you, I don't know Joe, to expose the truth. He don't. Okay, fuck it. I'll tell you. I think I know where you're going. I'll tell you. I'll tell, 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 tell you. As a new artist. It may not be Glorilla. Maybe she don't know. Maybe your Gotti don't know. Clearly somebody somewhere don't know. But somebody who works with Glorilla mm -hmm. is 100% hitting people in the town to say, yo, if you got 30, we'll pop up for a quick song. Uh -huh. That's happening. Uh -huh. <laughs> that is 100% happening. Mm -hmm. No doubt about it. Of course, of course it's happening. That's the phase we all go through. Wait, is it, it's a 40? It's 40 over there? Five mm -hmm. minutes? Hey, I'll tell That you. don't mean that that's your rate. But if you got 30 or 40 for me for a quick five minutes... And I'm in the town already for whatever I'm in the town for. I'm showing up. I'm picking mm -hmm. that up yeah. and I'm leaving. Talk about I'm it. Glorilla. These veneers are not tricking me. <laughs> That's still Glorilla mm -hmm. from wherever she's from with her hood rat friends that got the hit, blah, blah, blah. That's still who that is. How do you just shoot up? But let me shut up. I get it. See, but that's when you that's what happens when shit like that 50-year hip-hop performance happen. When you put her in situations like that. Now, when she leave there, she get to say shit like, Nigga, dog, I, I need 60 and better to perform. I just mm -hmm. perform Wait, mm -hmm. who are you telling that to? <laughs> Not them promoters that's in the streets gathering their money up. Because let me tell you something. Them niggas got a little more experience with who can fill what spot and who can't fill what sure. spot. Talk about mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. They true. know. Well, a lot of them do. The good ones. If you could fill this spot with their crowd, their audience, they people that they've been in the town for fucking their whole fucking life. Mm -hmm. I don't know that I'm, if it's me, and I got no experience in this, I'm not taking my 30 grand and banking that Glorilla is selling out my club. I'm not doing that. Ooh. I say that respect. What city was it in? Oakland. I, you don't think I'm you're talking about my 30 grand. I'm not, I'm not talking about her ability to do it. I'm talking about my 30 grand. That's not I'm a sure. Saying, I'm that's not a sure a enough. Today. Yeah. And, and, and the position yeah, but of a promoter today in the inner city, you can't give Glorilla fifty grand and have her come pack out, escape in North. I mean, and Elizabeth. Ain't no, my salute. See, to yeah. I'm not gonna say what I was about to say. I'm talking ticket prices today, where everything got to be VIP. We selling would, tables and sections. Well, in New Jersey, I don't think Glorilla sells out barcode. See, and that's what I'm saying. And but over there, I, that might be different. Yo, so it's, I, that's, that's why I said, what city? Because the city matters. Um, what I'm saying is this. Oakland is a tough city to sell in, mm -hmm. by the way. It is. It is. I believe you. I, I don't know nothing about that. Okay, I don't was know the, the club, size of this was, was it packed at all? It looked packed. It looked packed. But but when you but say many packed, people, yeah, well, listen, that's what I said. The size of the venue matters. That the matters. capacity yeah, yeah, yeah. matters. That because matters. now it becomes an issue of math. If this, if this crowd holds 1,000 people, mm -hmm. And we giving her fifty grand, nigga. We gotta charge fifty dollars a head just to recoup our money. Yes. People buying bottles, you know what I mean? sections, bottles that today. Because that, that today, that, that now comes into play. But I'm sure. saying, I, I, I can see it happening. All of bro. that stuff matters. I can see it happening. Because I want to just sense. make the money off the bottles. I want to get. I want to oh, yeah, get some bread. Of course, yeah, of course. Yeah, so y'all don't think. And that, you still got other bills so to pay that night. What's security, the you gotta pay security, security, you gotta pay. Yeah, you got bills. What's the max you guys think that Glorilla could? I can't count nobody else's pockets. I'm just saying. I, the max is whatever you can get. Yeah. So it's right. whatever her and her team could get. No, not the money, people. Like, if you're saying that, I, I think, don't think that she could pack up. I think it depends up. on the region. That also, that also, yeah. If, I, that if I'm a promoter, uh -huh. if you're asking me to be the promoter I think that, that, that's booking Glo Glorilla, and I'm doing it in her hometown, or I'm doing it in Memphis, where I maybe will get some support from her label, mm -hmm. her crew. Like, those are the two places I feel matters. most comfortable yep. booking her, me. Because if you're in Memphis, then you hoping but as a promoter my money. that Yo Gotti gonna come. You hoping that uh -uh. some of the other people from the label might just show up with her. Uh -uh. Hoping. Uh -uh. No, you're not. Not today. If you're a promoter, you know better than that. If I give you more than 30 grand, money you know bag, that. yo, better be walking in that door with you or a nigga dressed up as a money bag. If I give you more than 30 grand, oh, somebody other than just your team better be coming through the door. You better have some microphone. I better... I want to you give me two something from fuck nigga free. I'm asking you, have y'all <laughs> been in the spot and heard her two records ring off? Had seen what it did to the ratchet women in the in the mm -hmm. spot? That's why I, I, they could pack a spot. Uh oh, I love Glorilla this. up there. Oh, we they could so, pack a spot. We having a good talk now. We having now, a good talk now. 
<laughs> Joseph, what's up? <laughs> Those people that you're talking about, the Ratchet Girls, uh -huh. not that I know them. They got eighty dollars a head. Yeah, we, we said fifty, and I said I, I said fifty based on a thousand. Do they have fifty dollars a head? This is not me saying that. Don't y'all do it to me. <laughs> to answer you, all of them know they don't. To answer don't you. all. But wait, what? I, some <laughs> nigga, some, some of them, them got some, 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 some bread. We're not gonna some play. Got 50. Now true. again, the baddie little ratchets. Have y'all seen the, that fuck nigga free video? I'm not talking about that video. Yes, I've seen it. I, I've been in the spots where the song come on. Same. And the women, the 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 classy ones, the ratchets, they all in unison love that record. They rap the fuck out of that record. It don't be more than 100 girls. That's not what happens up here. I'm, bro, it don't be over 100 girls. I'm not saying... I know dogs, you. I believe dogs. you. I'm not saying 100 girls. I'm telling you, they get these girls to a spot. They can now get the niggas to a spot. You can now... The niggas got to come out. You got to impress... You got to have a section. You got to have your bottles. They're going to upcharge all of this shit. You can make your money off putting Glorilla on a flyer. Yeah, because the ratchets bring the niggas up. You can put your money... You can make your money <laughs> off putting Glorilla on a flyer, dog. You can. I'm you 100% can. You. I'm with you on that. But that was never the argument. But that is part of the argument because so now if That's I, why for me I'm if, only talking about if it were my money. 50, yeah. That's what I'm saying. If I'm a promoter and yo, these motherfuckers is the new league, the new era of rap. These artists, when you got a record, not let alone two, that's making noise like this, they're expensive. You're right. You're not getting them for the old 15, 20s like that no more. These niggas is running up numbers. I've, I know promoters that just put a certain nigga in XL and Every, had to pay everything, him everything six Ice, digits. Ice is saying is right, but there's the old saying where relationships are everything. If it has to go to where you're saying, then promoters won't be able to make a living. They won't be able to make a living. You have to have a relationship. And I don't want to talk about this like this is the worst thing I've ever heard because it's not. <laughs> and like, I don't want to make it seem I, like I, know I don't some want rappers, her her money. I know some rappers that didn't have the hit and didn't have this type of support or visibility that was running around cracking you niggas. And y'all promoters knew y'all wasn't going to get your money back, but some of y'all promoters be dick riders. Dick riders. Uh -huh. Y'all be wanting to book niggas just so y'all can meet them. Uh -huh. It's a tricky game out there in those streets. Sure Congrats is. to Glorilla. Right. I want her to get every single dime that she can get. And the other part that we all overlooking, like you said, somebody is around there shopping at 30. That might not be the number that they think they, they shopping. That's 1,000% happening. Mm. Nigga, you yeah. could have thought this was a $15,000 booking or, or something, 18. You didn't know that I got these niggas for 30? That's true, too. And that's happened quite a few times. Well, now, Wait, how much? Why does she say she expected more? Not now that it's at public. Because I be, and because I know that it was a, you wanted a record and a song. And, yo, wait, hold up, what? You might have tried the game. True. The promoter dude, and we'll we'll leave this, he is saying, I ain't got no reason to lie, and I was promised a performance. That's that's what he's saying. What I'm saying is, whatever was paid and whatever was promised, she certainly showed up. That I won't put too much stock in that, because I've showed up. I've had this fight for pennies on this dollar. <laughs> but every all of us have had this fight of, mm -hmm. no, dog, you booked me for a hosting. That do not mean I'm going next to the DJ booth to rap along uh -huh. with my song right. <laughs> while it's not even a stage in this place. See, some niggas do that. So that's what happens. A couple niggas do that. That's a courtesy. Yeah, but what happens is if you get a couple niggas that do it, you tend to think, oh, all right, you know, let me make you, you cool. Come here, come here, do this. True. No, I'm not doing that. No, I ain't, I ain't some doing people that. are strictly about their business. I learned this late. I, I remember I, was with, I went with Fab to a club in, uh, in Elizabeth. Dog, we got to that spot at like 12 something. It was um, All Star years ago. We got to the spot like 12 something. Niggas stayed upstairs until 2, no, excuse me, 145. Came out, did a half a verse of Diamonds in My Damn Chain, a half a verse of uh, Make Me Better, and then the lights came on. It was like, damn, I would stay and rock with y'all, but they telling us we gotta go. I'm looking at him like, nigga, these niggas paid to see you. You was upstairs for ever. You could have been hit the stage. Nigga was like, no, nah, nigga. This is business. This is the business. Some, so some other niggas would have got there and, and give you a little extra. You know, you, you, I, I know, oh, it's packed in here. Cool, let me give you two songs. Yeah. Let me give you three songs. Like, some niggas, is, this, is a, this is a business deal, bro. I'm here to get my money. Whatever we agreed upon is what I'm giving you, and I'm out. That's it. That's it. That's it. 
Black China says she's broke. What does that mean? <laughs> so she was on the red carpet of the Grammy saying that she's broke. But oh, you yeah? said otherwise. Yeah. Nice. To me, she been like she was bro- I don't know. I'm sorry. <laughs> Do you know how much money she was saying she w- had from her OnlyFans? I think, is she, is she about to go back to court? I'm, I'm going in. Come on. Dude. Is that what's happening? Turn me up. <laughs> Turn me up. <laughs> yeah, I'm going in. Yo, go. Who is Black China? That's, <laughs> that's the Kardashian baby mother, right? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Okay. Mm-hmm. And, um... She said she broke, ish. How you feel about that? And Tiger baby mother, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Well, Tiger and Rob said they was giving oh, her on Sundays. 30 or 40 bands a month. <laughs> on Sundays. <laughs> so she making it 70? <laughs> she yo, making 70 they, a they, month? They went yeah. public and said, it's yo. It's do some math. 70 a month? How much that is? 840 grand. Joe Parker. <laughs> What? She got him. <laughs> she got him. <laughs> okay, hold on. Hold on, let me rethink. I, I can't go in. Hold, hold. Plus yeah, her OnlyFans. Plus her OnlyFans. Yeah. Uh, yeah. How much she said OnlyFans was doing? <laughs> did she get, what did she say? She said she was making like 20 million from it? She said a lot. Yo, let, me, a lot. let me say this real quick, though. Like, we're we going to stop hyping these OnlyFans. Are you bitches fucking on there? That's what we want to see. No. I'm sorry. I want to see that. So she, I got to sign up Fam, for shit. No, for real. <laughs> is she doing what y'all say? This no, 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 she is. For real? Who is? I'm gonna talk to her about that tonight. Watch your peoples? Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay, I got it. I don't give. I, no, my thing is <laughs> she's not <flip>. yours. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go. I'm about to get you. Yeah, I'm about to get you. Well, Think about this diamonds story. and pearls. Stupid ass pants, nigga. Fuck what you Fuck I gotta be cool with her. Your homegirl getting fucked, nigga. Ass up. Sucking dick. With a red camera. Looking like a McFooling thing in the kitchen with a bad stove. Are you dumb? Fuck you talking about. That's my friend. I don't, don't want to claim her friendship, nigga. Why? Because she getting fucked nastily. Some of your girlfriend's homegirls. I ain't see it. Now. I ignore watching that. True. Okay. <laughs> I ignore watching that. I can't face that shit. Your people not getting fucked. That shit kind of nice. Though. I go, I'm here. That shit nice. Though. Yo, he dog. Just... But again, why would you? Why would you do that if you can make money not having to do that? Because you be in the system, though. No. Gotta... So what, nigga? You now, too. Now let me pull up my OnlyFans. Come on, come nigga, on. Nigga, we from the bottom. Beating the system is w- congratulated. Know, hey, yo, hold on. Now. You wouldn't want to see Black China ass up in the air. I don't even know. Black China could be at that. Table, yes, yeah, apparently he don't, I don't know who really she is. I, she is, so I don't know. Who, who she is. ass would you prefer to see in the air? Oh, who or who? We got another <laughs> a friend of the show. Where I guess. <laughs> who or who, who? Look, to answer your question, dog, Mel, mm-hmm. no, I don't think black China was broke. Okay, the quote she the, the statement she said, what's her government name? Angela White. She said, Angela White has three thousand dollars in her checking account, <laughs> she's broke, right. I'm sure she has a corporate. But, but <laughs> BC LLC. LLC yeah. That's all be. I heard from that was, oh, okay, I see what you're doing. Sure. Salute. Hold up, man. Let me tell a quick story getting at some of these OnlyFans bitches. <laughs> and I unfollowed all of them. Except for two. <laughs> here go this bitch right here talking about something. This was a locked video. <laughs> and you're, you're a burner account, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, they all burner accounts. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you're not on... You shouldn't be on OnlyFans you as mean? you. <laughs> a verified account on OnlyFans. Here you go, this chick in the locked video was locked. Talking about some wet hot tub fun with the uh, water emoji. Mm-hmm. And it says, watch the splash. I'm thinking she about to be on there following uh, squirt, <laughs> squirting yeah, yeah, on the yeah, wall. Yeah. So I click the shit. I buy it. Yeah. How much was it? What she sold this shit for? $19.99. Mm. I little, buy it. Little quick dub. Let me see how long. How long? I was going to ask you how long, see how long it is. Let me see. All right, four minutes. That Don't you promising. know this bitch is washing her foot? Uh, <laughs> I was just about to say no. if she got some bubble bath in there, Dude, just sprinkling the water with her toes. Nigga, I wrote with the lube in my hand. <laughs> <laughs> I wrote luby never again. <laughs> hey, read, read that right. What, what that say, man? What that say? What that say right there? Wet hot tub. No, no, oh, under wait, that. Wait. Never, <laughs> never, never again. again. Never again, Ma. Mama. Mama. Mama, never again. <laughs> See, now nah, I'm, 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 I'm filing chargeback. My car was stolen or something. You so ain't, get, you ain't wait, getting wait. that off. I ain't going to do that. Okay. You're not getting that off. I ain't going to do that. Wait, no, you're wait. not getting that off. So it stayed just on her feet? Yes. Genius. Fucking See? genius. And that's so why, that why salute to Reddit. <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, I, I, do, I do foot porn. Ish. Huh? Well, not really. 
porn. Wait, with ish. Like, <laughs> whoa. whoa, wait, wait, what? chill, Yo. chill. You blow up. Oh, chill. <laughs> hey, we, we ain't gonna talk about murder. <laughs> <ain't>. <laughs> no, um, you can I flip on. What do you mean? Uh, they, like foot, like um, ballet and shit. Foot fetish <laughs> stuff. You know what I mean? Like, so I'll do a video with my feet. You know, um, smashing cake. Um, but and, where? Huh? Where? On. On my page. Tell us, stop co-signing shit. Chill. Like, tell us stop. Tell us stop. Talk to please. Talk why to are you mad? Talk to your people. Why are you mad? Like, we talk to people, bro. Huh? Where you're smashing cake with your feet on, like, where? On my page. Only Like Twitter. Only fans. Yeah. You have an OnlyFans Answer only, the question directly. You have, you have only OnlyFans page? I, you know I do. Oh, wait. Yes. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Oh, shit. You know what I mean? He's out there. I didn't even know you could hit that note. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I didn't know you could hit that note. Let me hear it. Don't deflect. Don't deflect. No, we get right back. Don't deflect. Let me hear the note. Let me hear the note. Hold on. Talk about that 1999 for that wet fun. You going against the rules. I'm going down. No, you going against the rules of the, what's that shit y'all went to? What's the rule? Sensitivity. You can't buy your co-host only niggas is getting quiet whoa 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 whoa, 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 whoa. Look how fast you made me purchase. We <laughs> Look how fast you made me purchase. We didn't say And I that. knew about male OnlyFans because you told me. I never told you no shout out to Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah. You got me. Yeah. You got me. Hey, Yo, come out, we court. We, we got to come out. When we're not getting hey, fired. Hey, come on out. Uh, I want Steve Lacey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, they said Steve Lacey hey, came yo, out too, by the way. Hey, fire, hey, yo, fire her, bro. She can't have OnlyFans. No, the, 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 I, already, I already asked the motherfucking boss. C-O-E, oh, man. He encouraged C-O-E. it. Hey. He encouraged hey. it. Mel- okay? <laughs> listen, listen. I'm giving him a free C-O-E. preview right oh, now. Hey. Oh, hey. Damn. <laughs> Yeah, you are a freak. You are a freak. Stop. Get your urges under control. We at work, nigga. <laughs> There's a Rosie and Levi's. You freak ass nigga. Get out of here, boy. Go outside and get some air. Oh. Hey. Yeah, I mean. At the network, we let you keep your OnlyFans page. <laughs> <laughs> come, come work with us. <laughs> what were you? Okay, so what were you Mel, saying? Mel, that's yeah. all you're doing on your page is smashing cakes. Oh no, 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 no! I'm doing um, more than that. What else? Huh? I you see. have to buy the motherfucking membership. How much is the membership? Huh? You be scamming them though. Scamming them. You be scamming yeah, them. Yeah. Do you do? Do you do the shit like he oh, just showed yeah, you? Yeah, yeah. Where it's just like some bullshit. And, and this is a commercial, it's right? It's so. misleading. It's misleading. It's misleading. No, 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 hey, this, no, no, this no. This month's subscribers. No. I need a couple of them. <laughs> <laughs> a long little commercial break here. No, okay. We're not, we're <laughs> no, but let's. I want to hear. It. No, I mean it's um, it's not just feet. It's you know, look. I was like, I was a lingerie and bikini model. I'm very comfortable. With my body, and I have a fan base that appreciates it. Yeah, I went it. to the class, so I'm not gonna ask. There's no the more king. Ma- there's, no more, want- there's no <laughs> more. There's no more. <laughs> I did go to the class, so I'm not. Again, I'm not gonna ask the question that they want. They want to ask. I know it's okay. I'm glad that you Yo, can. You ain't go to the sensitivity. Yeah, fuck, do it. <laughs> I'm not asking no questions. No, I'm good. You want me to get? You want me to get attacked on on, on Twitter? And Somebody's on girl is at this party. <laughs> 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 Shaking that right. ass to this. Trackmaster. <laughs> Somebody, <laughs> somebody's girl is at this party. <laughs> Go on a track like. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Let's go. Hey. Uh, uh, are we supposed to be playing? Yeah, we got this? That too. No, okay, good. Yo, Wait, like, how much is mail shit? It's cheap. That shit twenty dollars. Oh, niggas got nineteen dollars for mail. I know. <laughs> you, got, you got a lot. You got a lot. This old vintage this thing. <laughs> you got a lot of people on that mail. You think? Or? Um, Wait, yeah. That's a joke. You do it all right. Get off of this. All right. Okay. Okay. Enough. Uh, Black China. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you shit. Said the vintage Mel thing. robbing niggas on there, too. She I know is. she is. She I know is. she is. I'm I know she, she robbing niggas on there. She's smashing cake with her feet. I can tell, too. Mm-hmm. There, do you know, there's a lot of guys you know that have foot fetishes. Old, old, God, I'm just saying. All right, I got shit. you. I and got they you. like my feet. So, you, anyways. All right, before we move on, yeah. though, could you tell me how, how you are? Uh, 
pitch the uh, private message. Misleading. Hey, daddy. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> What's that? The <laughs> private, the private, like I just, like, like, just like the chick just, like I just read. Oh, I thought that was like a caption for the picture. No, that's a private message. That's when, that's where they really get the money. The privates. Let me tell you how bad it is. Yeah, Everybody it. that I unfollow, <laughs> they continue to send me privates. <laughs> she about to get hers. Okay, there you go. Oh yeah, read a script. Read a script. Uh oh, don't what, stop. What you got for Move. us? Hell, you hear this guy? Where my girl at? Let me go to my favorite. Y'all, wow. Do you guys really want me to read it? Yeah, yeah. read it. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, you can read it. You ain't go to the class yet, Erickson. <laughs> this is the one. But read it like how you should read it. Hey, don't yeah, read it. Yeah, I don't, I don't want point. her sitting next to me no more with OnlyFans with uh, her, her picture out like that. Okay, one of them is um, don't forget about no, these. No, 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 no. Put, no, no, put no, a little sauce put the voice on, on it, man. Oh. Put the voice. Don't forget about how suckable these titties are. Oh, she, Mel, you can Mel, take a break, Mel. Mel. <laughs> she typed. She, she, Mel. She, she typed like an old bitch. <laughs> That's like a a sixties porn movie. That's what the. Ooh yeah. <laughs> Yo, don't tell me what's suckable in the message. <laughs> hey, Mel, okay, out. I didn't write that. Oh one. my god, I didn't write wait, that. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 wait. I have. She I got a team. ghost. I've got Wait, that it's a team. No, I just saw them. That was Ian. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't put all in that. Are you crazy? Huh? You got a team. I just saw her. I was only a business. No. All right, give yeah. us one more. R read us one more that you wrote. There's no That you wrote, though. Not, not one that your peoples wrote. Okay. Damn. No, wait. I need that for the music one more time. Oh. All you gotta do is press pay <laughs> to play. <laughs> nah, that ain't gonna work, man. Nah, that ain't gonna get it. That ain't gonna get it. That's not gonna get it, homie. I'm gonna keep it a buck. <laughs> you know what you gotta do, Mel? You gotta go on some of these 2023 chicks' pages. Yeah, man. Okay, what did they say? Still ain't verbiage. What did they say? Oh, shit. Pamela Anderson. I don't know I'll be on I bet you know Pamela Anderson just dropped a That ain't gonna get it done. Uh, well, mm, my uh, You want some oh, playboy shit? shit. <laughs> Play that. that nigga said you Crystal Waters CC Peniston ass captions <laughs> Go ma'am Go ma'am Go go ma'am Fuck you just stupid shit. <laughs> Okay well read me a script That you guys would like to hear What would you like to read I've never been on OnlyFans Okay, What, what would you like to said. read I wouldn't like to read that bullshit <laughs> Say something then I can't tell you what to say but Man, you male. You M4. You four women in one. Smart, fat, skinny, Fuck all of you. Yo, a, poem, all in one. a poet may not be one of the four women, nigga. Okay. So you know then I saying? just then I'll just do like emojis and shit. Uh, the tongue in the water. Helps. That's better than that. The that's tongue in the that. water. The tongue yeah, in the water. The wheelchair. Okay. <laughs> the the some crutches. <laughs> tongue cherries. Okay. <laughs> Oh. Tongue banana. Oh shit! If you don't take this fucking yo, shit off, Melissa, yo, <laughs> it's that three. It's now that I three almost feel one. like just just for research purposes, I gotta go see what's going. On. You can't, but yo. I'm not. No, I'm you not, can't. I'm not doing it. You can't do that. You know what? It's you okay. Can't do that. It's, it's, but I know you nasty niggas out there. Oh no, they'll do it. They're going. Yeah. Oh yeah. I just gotta go on Reddit. Yeah, Red Reddit be like, oh shit, him for popping this off. <laughs> See, it's a whole different Reddit. Popping this vintage. Wait, <laughs> 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 hey. stop. <laughs> I hate y'all. All right. <laughs> <laughs> this is not funny. I hate y'all. Oh, <laughs> go subscribe. Burr. There you go. In, in, yeah, only, uh, in OnlyFans news, Amber Rose's son came out and defended his mother's OnlyFans. Talk about it. I'm sorry? Mm -hmm. What happened? His friend was talking about uh, her having an OnlyFans page, and mm -hmm. he said, we, <laughs> as boys, you, you have to let women do, which, interesting word, but you have to let women do what they want to do. How, how old is he? Nine. What? Now, is this, is this, uh, tech? What? Wiz Khalifa. Wiz Khalifa's son? Yeah. Bash. Bash. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
Respect. Yeah. Yeah. She's been on interviews. But for my time, when you see me, you know everything. Yo, that that's Come on, a, that's Justin, a real. Talk. Call, we are in a we are in a talk. We're in a space now yes. with social media and all of the interactions where that got to be kind of difficult for young boys now. True. Like, fair. Talk about it. Fair. Keeping it a buck, that got to be difficult for young boys. We we never had to um, deal with no shit like that. Hey, I, fair. Let me ask you a question. Imagine you in middle school, seventh grade, seven, somewhere in there, right? And a nigga, you just pull your mom's up on the phone. You think you just go? We you, you said a regular PS one hundred and one. I don't care where it you don't at. matter. Bro. I don't care. He could be at Cheesequake Prep. It, men, boys is boys. Yeah, that don't change nothing. I mean, it, it, there I might be a couple <laughs> other kids with. <laughs> you don't think kids are affected by that joke? <laughs> It's yo, probably a couple other yo, kids. Whose side are you on right now? <laughs> I, mean, I, mean, I got to ask. Dog, we had Because right while I'm in the middle of cracking up at them, like on the low, here you coming out <laughs> like me. <laughs> what, so what do you want from me right now? I'm just saying, what are you laughing at? Flip going to stand up. <laughs> them. You laughing at their opinion on it. I'm laughing at mad shit that shouldn't be shared. Okay. <laughs> okay. Fam, you say what you, whatever you want. I, we've all been boys before. Mm. Sans Mel. That is a complicated and difficult situation. Mm. When your mom's is like her. Your mother being pretty enough is going to get the compliment. I mean, mm -hmm. get the comments. Mm -hmm. But if your mother is now giving it up or showing shit that's revealing and doing certain things, you're going to get teased. I, we, we, the shit happened with Drake and um, the dinner at Dodger Stadium. Uh -huh. and, and Joe was like, yo, you crazy. He's going to be the man when he go to school. And I said, no, he not. Next thing you know, they roasting that little nigga all, all on the internet. That's a complicated situation for your kids. He mm -hmm. feel like so. So what, what happened when the little <laughs> nigga tell 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 your son, "Yo, man, tell your mom's next picture, yo, spread it a little bit further." What happened then? What happened when the little nigga? Well, if that's like, gonna be, if that's already his lip? response, I think that he's gonna handle that. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Shoot this <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, Thank you. Well, Finally, well. a real nigga answer. Yes, Ice. That's what happens when that happens. The kids shouldn't be able to finish the sentence. He'll tell your mom. <laughs> That's what happens True. when that happens. Just so we clear on True. that. That's one. Two, yes, we could be mature and look at it from the mature point of view, but I want to go back to Ice's original question, which was, if what if when you was in school, <laughs> that made me think about when I was in school, that you could just look at niggas' moms? <laughs> That shit is lit. <laughs> what the fuck? Indeed. Are y'all girl dads over there talking Bruh, about? I'm this not shit saying is that. Nah, that's, dope. that's not what I'm talking about. That's dope. You talking about from the kids' perspective? Yeah. I'm only talking about the kids' perspective. I'm going to fuck what the mother do. It affects the kid in school. All right, since you're forcing me to be mature, I'm, oh, when man, you make that bro. face right, and you dog. talk with that tone and conviction, you got it, if no, I don't, it, if I don't match your maturity, mm -hmm. they all will laugh at me. It's cool. So bro. I offer you, you this. I'm no. Not. I'm offering this to you. I, I offer you this. I, I give it to keep you it, anyway. Moms is busting it open in school. Everything you just said is true. The little kids is pressing... The, uh, the, the kid in school, they cracking jokes. You know kids in school, they cracking jokes, mushing that nigga, putting the pictures up, group chat, lunchroom. It's all bad. What if mom don't have no other way to support all these little badass kids? What if without this, they would be homeless, fucking starved, carless? Kids don't know nothing about all of the bills and all the expenses mm -hmm. that it costs to take care of these little motherfuckers. And this is how you getting it done. Or, yes, but before you say it, there are other ways to get it done. But mom is cracking them. Not Mel, but women mm -hmm. like Mel are cracking them mm -hmm. over there. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure so we'll that's where I want to drive the conversation. What you're saying is true. What I'm saying is true. What is the appropriate way for that to be dealt with outside of my kid beating up your kid? It's no appropriate way. It's no appropriate way. When your son steps out on that ledge and cracks some jokes, he better yeah. have a knuckle. Man, I, just, be I, hold on. With it. I just watched the Pamela Anderson Lee documentary. Freaky ass nigga. And she and stand up for real <laughs> on Netflix. Make sure you check it out. Well, as a Jamaican, you and, watched that? And her children 
Her children was going to school. They had to learn karate. Her children was fighting all the time. I'm telling you. <laughs> That's what I'm telling you. <laughs> That's literally what I'm saying. They were doing this and shadow. I'm like, look at this shit. They were doing this and this. They were literally watching this dog now. What? Yeah, it was fire. Little niggas had to be mad. They was violating them. And that's when the internet first got crazy. True. That's when that what tape I'm saying, on the internet. Right? And that story, and that you story have to come huge. with that. That story was we Imagine got, what those two little karate guys. Billy and John went through. <laughs> crazy. You gotta do that. Yeah, uh-huh. she was just. She was actually just on uh, Drew Barrymore's show, and they were, you know, they were both like they both had reputations when they were younger, <clears throat> and they were talking about the fact that they're adults now, and having had children, they weren't thinking about the fact that they had they were going to have kids eventually, and yep. that what they have done in their past as you know younger people affected their kids. That's but it, to saying. me, it just seems like Bash, he's. He's being raised by Amber Rose, the creator of the Slut Walk. You know what I'm saying? Like he, has she has nothing to do. Has with everything to do with it. He's gonna have a different approach. He's gonna have a different. It, that, shit, at, shit's not gonna land at, on shout him. Out to Drew Barrymore. At na- hold on, at nine years old, that that, that statement he made. At, <laughs> at, nine, holy mail. at nine years old, you guys, you have to let a woman. And then why you gotta squint to read? Why you can't read normal? What's Why, are you saying? Doing? Why are you squinting? The, the hands right <laughs> that nigga You squint. have to let a woman do what she wants with oh her body. Oh my God, you got to poke your neck out like a, <laughs> like a giraffe to read. Huh? You have, have to let a woman bullshit. do what she wants to do. That's what, his, that's what her son said to his friend. First of all, chill out. Don't, don't, don't correct me ever like that with reading. I'm ever just, in your life. Look. Learn how to read. <laughs> I can't see it. But at the same time, that's not a little nigga thinking on his own. His father ain't teaching that. I know. Wiz ain't teaching that. And I know Wiz. Uh, he ain't teaching <laughs> I got a new I'm off of that. I got a new question. Y'all all got daughters, right? <laughs> I'm asking a question. Yeah, yeah I'm about to follow up. I got a daughter. All right, y'all, yeah. y'all got daughters. I got a daughter. <laughs> Stop. I have a question. Right, so stop. I want to ask my question. Because <laughs> y'all mentioned like teaching kids how to fight and all that shit. <laughs> <laughs> my, my baby mom gonna send me <laughs> some karate, karate school video. <laughs> Tell my old dog, I will fuck that instructor. <laughs> so my question to y'all, I got a son, so my talk gonna go a little different. But my question to y'all is, how can y'all teach y'all daughters to fight? Y'all can, right? You can. No, you yeah. can't. You can, yeah. My daughter was in MMA for like six years. Your daughter what? She was in MMA for six years. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Uh, I'm not talking about extreme sports. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like for school. <laughs> what do you mean? What, I don't, what, I'm what? asking. You can't. Teach I, the I same don't want to hear from MMA. Man, no, the no same more. shit you do with your sons. It ain't no different. You talking about teach them yourself? For real? You mean like you teaching them to fight? Or putting well, them? Well, that's in, what, what both. a dad could do. And, a, and dad could do that with a girl too. How? What? Wait, wait, I'm wait. asking. Throw a fucking Put hand. your hands up. One, one, two, one. You, you don't see that all, all on he, online nowadays. He just dropped me for stop doing that. No, no, I'm really asking. No, nah, he asking, asking serious, serious, serious questions. Question. I'm asking serious questions. Dog, it be it be fathers on their knees with their daughters with you the mitts teach your on. Daughter how to square up? Yes, yeah, nigga. Yeah, nigga. Why not? She might have to square up one day. Shit, real. Oh, y'all long raising head. like killers. <laughs> what the no, fuck? Like, you gotta be in, <laughs> yo, this world yo, don't yo, fuck with you. You gotta be in the finger They don't. No wonder. Be in the finger No wonder feminism is dead. They what? Equal rights, no, nigga. There no, you go. No wonder it's hard to find a soft woman Yo, out there. One, Jeez. one, two, one, Man, two, I just watched three. A, I just watched a video of a Pamela Anderson, right? No, Baywatch. No, uh, no on, on Twitter <laughs> of five girls jumping a black girl in, in the UK. No, I seen some shit the other day. And the mom was like, "Yeah, get her, get her." The mom and all that. <laughs> I'm like, "If that's my daughter, I'm gonna go crazy." I'm just saying. Thank God I taught her put an MMA and taught her how to fight. I want you to poke them little. I want you to poke their eyes out. <laughs> Bite them in their mouth. <laughs> Choke them. For real. My daughter here is long up to here. Sorry. Up to here. First thing they're going is for her hair. True. They're going to pull her. She's going to go like that. Nah. And when they oh, pull her hair. Yeah. You got you to cut that. You got to cut it. When they pull her hair, that mean they hand exposed. And you boo bop the daylights out there. But hold on. But a lot of people pull their hair to the side. Mm-hmm. It goes on the side pulling a punch. Mm-hmm. All right. I have a new question now because this is so much fun. <laughs> When your kid gets beat up in school, tell me the parent that you are when you go up there. Come on, I want to hear. Give me who who you looking for, Mr. Johnson, 
And what's nah. and what's your first thing? Oh, you looking for the kid? <laughs> Yo, Jr. got jumped, and I went. I got, it, it went viral. He got jumped on, and, and I went on the football field threatening don't, to shoot the kids. Don't tell me about the dude. That's different. That's <laughs> your son getting beat up. Yeah, like me going on the football field at his high school. I kill one of you niggas. I'm Queens flip acting crazy. He has it. Oh, hold on, sir. Why do you keep saying I'm Queens flip? Cause I just like, 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 like people know him. <laughs> oh, that him? <laughs> El Chapo. <laughs> Why you got crack jokes about I'm not you, my man. No, yeah, that's that's why you got jump. Man. You got jump. That that's was why. Joe. That wasn't ish. And you can't. You got me in trouble. <laughs> you you so said that my shit. Brothers, I, I started them. laughing. <laughs> them niggas <laughs> tore me up. They was bad. Shout out to them. Shout them out. Cause I know them. They said they chased you. What? They said they chased you. My man said, yeah, we got him. We chased him. <laughs> <laughs> you ran it like, went like this. Or something. I, I got know. so many jokes right now. <laughs> Stop. The fourth of it is a flip trap. It. I'm not I'm paying not. Flip no mind because he's lying. <laughs> Yo. I ran one time in my life from a fight. This is how I know that I don't run because I ran out of breath, me and my brother. I had to, I had to turn around and fight. <laughs> that sucked when... <laughs> The running is the plan, and you can't do it. You can't get the run out. <laughs> Fuck. And my home, my house was a block away, and you already got a breath. Now you got to fight out of breath. My house was a block away. That's when me and my brother was flying too. Shout out to him. Shout out to your brother. Yo, you was gonna bring him to your crib? <laughs> no, that wasn't the plan. Man. I'm saying you was running toward home. Is that <laughs> you gonna get to your porch? Like, ah. <laughs> what the fuck you gonna do? Yeah, I don't know why I thought that I could put enough distance between us to where they wouldn't even see me. So I know you ain't had no triple double, yo. You wasn't no athlete. <laughs> yo, you're scared. You're the dust of them niggas. Some of them little bastards try to go in your crib. You can't run to your house. They try to push your door and all type of crazy stuff they do. Different. But it depends on how. My you brain know. didn't think like that back when I was very course, young when this fight happened. I was so. very young when I got this fight it, I got it. Okay. And people used to respect parents and shit like yeah, that. Sure. Don't do that shit no more. Now. They can tell your mother, come right outside. You Dog, I'm too. going to dinner last night. Last night, it should be a nice, quiet night on my way to, I won't say. And they got 8th Avenue fucked up over there because they killed, murdered somebody at 5.30 p.m. on shit. 44th In and Manhattan? 8th. Yeah. Yes. Dog, they killed somebody at 5.30. I wasn't going to dinner until my reservation was Hold 10. On. You said they killed or somebody died. It's different. They killed. Really? And didn't, they didn't catch the guy neither. <laughs> How you killed him? Yo, that's unusual. They shot him. That's unusual in Manhattan. Mm -hmm. yeah, that is very unusual in Manhattan. But, but for Sheesh. the people that's not familiar with New York, we're not just saying Manhattan. It's we're like talking about Broadway. Yeah, yeah we talk. Yeah. No, but even in Manhattan, they don't really be jokers getting killed. Like, the boroughs, it'll happen. But in, like, New York City, Lower East Side, maybe, but New Yo, York, be kind of... Square. Yeah. Everybody be scared. careful. Broad day, Word. too. That's Everybody, crazy, yeah, son. yeah. It was, yes, that's absolutely nuts. Was shot after a fight. 22-year-old. At 5.30 in the afternoon? 5.30 p.m. Times Square. <sighs> Yeah, that's that's crazy. Sheesh. That's where my little lube store used to be. <laughs> you had a specific that is the little store. kinky district. Yeah. That's the kinky district mm -hmm. over there. Oh, lube. I thought you meant lube. Louboutin. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's your lube store, right? It was the district for a second. Sorry. Oh, got it. Louboutin's there too, probably. Anyway, speaking of lube, Sobaton. anybody got any Valentine's Day plans? <laughs> <laughs> good one. We know you don't because wow, oh, shit. God damn, God damn, wow. that's wrong. Fuck, that was, that's I am. Why do you know that she don't? Wow, she's yeah. the one I'm banking on having a few plans. There we go. You see how she keeps stunting on us in the group chat? I, I can't. I can't talk about. <laughs> and the niggas that say good morning to me, I'm any, still mad any about name that. that we bring up. If we say Sydney Portier, Mel come in. Oh, such a doll he is. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, he he wrote me one. <laughs> yeah, like, yo, yeah. dog. All right, yo, you got it. It's Portier. I don't have a Sydney. Portier they only respond story. to Mel in the group chat, by the way, y'all. Eighth wall. They it's only a, respond to her. Oh my god. I said good morning to niggas, niggas. You <laughs> niggas said well, they you don't like, respond to you. Well, you lying anyway, they because I said good. And then Joe's the only hey, one thinking. You, you lying because I don't respond to Mel either. I don't respond to nobody in the group chat. It's true. He is very. I, ain't, okay. I ain't even see it. Don't be. Don't well, hit me, me in a DM, nigga, with a good morning. Listen. <laughs> Facts. It's fine, you guys. Valentine's Day plans. Yeah. Come on. Anybody got any? Do guys actually like Valentine's Day? Can no. I just... Wow. You, that's a, and that's you're a married. Good one, that's a good one. It ain't I don't for like us. Valentine's. It's not no. for us, yeah. It ain't for us. Patriarch. Maybe, yeah. 
That shit ain't for us. But yeah. why? Why? Why do? Why do you feel like you can't have any like expectations for Valentine's Day? Your own expectations. Because we're men. Okay. Niggas barely get the big piece of chicken. You talking about some <laughs> expectations for Valentine's Day? Okay. Niggas don't get Christmas gifts or none of that shit. Who? Who don't get Christmas gifts? I get Christmas gifts. So no, no, no. You on your own there, player. Uh, you bug it. I get gifts. <laughs> Y'all spoil. Because you act like cause you got his all the house money. be running different though. <laughs> nah, that's facts. Yeah, he, you run can. your house like, like a military, yeah. like a military base. <laughs> no spandex. <laughs> no black socks. <laughs> no Christmas. And no, and no Valentine's <laughs> Day. Like a military base. <laughs> well, like an atheist <laughs> one. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Your okay. box. Okay, then let me rephrase. Valentine's Day obligations, since this is oh, how you guys look at it. That's the good. Obligations. The guy dropped that dick off. <laughs> <laughs> the obligation is to make sure she's not the weak one in the group chat. Oh, that's got really it, it, got it, got, really it, it. Got, well, it got, got it, it. got it, got it, got it. Got it. That's it. Got it. Okay. It's no obligation. And ish? No? Nothing? I don't celebrate Valentine's Day. Does your girl? <laughs> she might be somebody else She don't do it with me oh, look, huh? This might go different Wait wait what? Easy No He's about to go oh, oh, No keep asking Keep asking I'm just saying Get Like Does she know Does she know how you feel about it Yeah me does and my she... girl Been together for a while and This they, man was okay? a tight ship You know who you're talking to Sergeant <laughs> <laughs> Sergeant Antoine <laughs> Bartholomew <laughs> Jr That's him Okay so are you just like Are you like the flowers guy Just cause Yeah Oh, yeah, so, so, so you wasn't here, so yeah. I a random Wednesday, anytime she get flowers. Yes, okay. Shout out to this, this guy. One and all. Dude. Okay, that's game. I like house that. full of flowers right now. They die. Oh, house full uh, of flowers. Mm. You know what I mean, it's cool though. Yeah, mm. all it's do is come to this podcast and lie. <laughs> that's all he do. My man said he could have took a picture of the flowers last time. I want him to take a picture of the flowers and send them. I want to see. I'm gonna send them tonight. I want to see them. Watch. Put yeah, them in the group chat. Go. Right on my island. Put them in the group chat. Put them in the group chat. <laughs> island better be. Don't go buy no flowers on the way home. <laughs> <laughs> no, he says they're dying, so we're gonna know. Okay. They yellow. Long stem, Look, short, short stem. They yellow. Long or short stem. So I'm making the color up too. Long. Right? They long, yellow. Long or short stem. I wish. One. Let me see if my girl going home. Oh, it's too late. She's going home yeah. for lunch. I don't mean to take a picture and send long, it. I'm just asking long or short stem. They don't even sell short stem roses really that much. They're super. They not them. Them. No, they not them. They regular. We're going to see. Uh, I cut them. We're going to see. They got cut them, put them in the vase, all that. Oh, yeah, long. Cut them on the angle, put them in the vase with the little wart stuff that come in the, the packet. Mm. Yo, yo, why why, why somebody lying if they ain't you, yo? Is that what I said? <laughs> yeah. You not me. All ish do is come here and lie. Man, and man, America look, celebrate then, Valentine's then you, Day. You, it's not me. <laughs> so, but then your goofy cronies run with it. Yo, ish lying, yo, yo, he lying. My I, goofy cronies. Yeah. They're the same ones that say this part will never be the same if you leave. No, that's how not can the, they be my that's goofy? That's not the majority. Hey, you, hey, y'all, hey, that ain't the majority. What's, what's the name of your hive? The Ishanites. <laughs> <laughs> yo, y'all hear that Ishanites? <laughs> yo, they don't run with the narratives. Mm. Listen, Mel, what are you doing for Valentine's Day? Some Pilates, some Why yoga, some some feet stuff. Misleading some a man, little, smashing a little cake. <laughs> Definitely misleading a man. All of the above. Mm. Swag. Yeah. No, we're not gonna let you get you away feeding with them that. the cake. No, hold on, y'all uh, be letting her get away with. What are you with doing on Valentine's yes. Day? Uh, Off the uh, toes. She's still promoting that page. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing on Valentine's Day, Mel? What am I doing on Valentine's Day? Um, I don't know what I'm doing. I think okay. I'm Valentine's I'm, Day will be the I'm 14th, accepting Tuesday, offers. Right? Four days. Or sifting through them, should I say? What are you doing? I'll be here. Facts. Work. Oh, on that's it. right. It's, it's Tuesday. It. Looks like we're, none of us are doing shit. Uh, All right. Womp, well, womp, well womp. no, I wanted to let y'all know because it's Tuesday and it's Valentine's Day, with the exception of Ish, because he don't celebrate this. If anybody does need to take off a Valentine's Day, please feel free. I don't want your jobs to be the reason that y'all can't celebrate love. I'm celebrating this weekend, so it's oh. cool. Mm. That's so she sweet. Waited. We got plans so the whole weekend. Joe, what about you, Joe? Well, I'll be at work. Okay. I'll be at work. I'm in a long distance relationship we at the tell. moment. At the moment. It's changing. Is that about to change? It might. Let's go, Joe. Oh, let's, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Stepping it up. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and I just can't. <laughs> you a corny L. I'll knock you out today. I'm not even in the mood for you. <laughs> Before you bogged out. 
He was just talking all that bullshit the other day. Fifth wall. He was talking all that bullshit. Like, oh, this is just fire. Now it's going to change. I knew you was blowing smoke in the air. How walls are there? Oh, you still, but no. Oh, the long, long distance relationship is fire. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's what you're saying. It is fire. It is. No, but you, so it's but, not. Uh, but you, but I, mm. I do, we do, as, as a group, as a collective, we do see growth in you. Pause. And, you know, it's good, man. Hopefully that the, it changes and, because you do need companionship. Yeah, I ask you to see like, growth Like my man Ish said today. He said he feel like people need companionship. Yes, Ish, you said that? So I think that Joe was one of them. Oh. Thanks. What, go ahead. Get your shit out. What are you saying? You know what I said. Like, you're going to ignore it, of course, because <laughs> you don't want to be able to, you know, expose your feelings. But, you know, you need companionship. I'm, and I'm, I'm happy that things may change. <laughs> Four years. Cause you don't plan on leaving this house. <laughs> nah, nah, I'm sorry. <laughs> hey, baby face on gave everybody what? a smash. <laughs> That's craziness. I wonder how much baby face got paid for this. You yeah. cause he put a verse on this. <laughs> Who's doing this first verse actually? Oh, that's John. That's John. I was there. He's singing on this weekend, too. my honor, can you give me someone to love? Someone to trust. Yo, I thought that's dope, actually. Uh, Tomorrow, 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 Saturday, right, at the Barclays, they're doing that Lover's, Lover's concert with Maxwell. It's and, a crazy uh, lineup. Yeah, the funny part is, though, the niggas threw Rock Him in it. That's is, funny. Is True Hurts so. performing? Why is he performing? I don't know, but that's funny. It's it's Max. It's a monster lineup, yo. Rock him is in the Lovers <laughs> yeah, Valentine's Day concert, <laughs> which is hilarious. And though. for the older people, right uh, on the same night, I want to say or Sunday, check that with Ticketmaster at the Beacon. They got like the Stylistics performing with the Carpenters and all wow. these other old groups. Wow. Like it's some fire in the city this weekend. Fire in the town. Fire in the town. Valentine's Day comedy show shit. I do want to check that. I want to check Caroline's it's to see old. who's over there. Nah, they got Caroline's one. They got one in Jersey. Down, they got one in Jersey. Caroline's closed down. It's closed. Or it's Caroline's closing. closed. Down. Caroline's does not close down. Nah, it, I will it's closed or closing. Yeah, it is. Caroline's is it gone is. out of business. Ish, stop. Shut up, yo. That's, a, that's yeah. facts. It's not a fact. That's yo. a fact. Let me let me hold up. Three people saying yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah word, I'm like, going to check. Tell them, yeah. I'm going to check. Right fact now, checker, you got to check your facts. I feel like just a few weekends ago, I went to Carolines.com. That wasn't a few Caroline's. weekends. That was more than a few weekends ago. Come. We yes, came in here and talked they're, about they're it. They're closing after thirty years, more than thirty years. Oh my God! Yeah, they're closed. Oh my God! <laughs> Thank you for thirty years of laughter in Times Square. This guy's crazy. We're excited about our future. We'll be sharing news on upcoming events and projects. On the nigga, I can't care about no fucking social media news. Be sure to follow us. We look forward to laughing with you again soon. Okay, so you want to hear the reason why? Yeah, I was just, I just, the landlord, the landlord wouldn't um, come down on the rent. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he raised the rent to compensate for money that it lost in the stock mm-hmm. stock market. That's why he, mm-hmm. yeah. It was all, oh, we talked about it. Dog, wait, 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 wait. That's foul. Wait, hold up, hold mm-hmm. up. The landlord of Caroline's. First mm-hmm. of all, why Caroline don't own Caroline's? But anyway, probably for <laughs> sale. <laughs> no, it's like this Kuwaiti born dude. And uh, yeah, that's why he raised the rent. That's fucked so up. So he got fucked in the stock shit. Mm-hmm. And it don't say what he raised the rent to. She no. said she she talked about it. We talked about this on the pod. She All said right. basically the landlord wouldn't work out a deal with her um, with regards to the rent, and that was it. All right, all right. Well, I'm sorry, I forgot all about that. It's a comedy show out in Jersey too. <clears throat> Eddie Griffin, Bill Bellamy. <laughs> Uh, Smokey Suarez, Adele Gibbons, like some some hitters. That sounds nice. When Saturday, where? Uh, New Jersey Pack, the Pack. Uh, New Jersey Pack. Mm. I guess some hitters. I feel like dealing with New Jersey Pack. I don't know. All right, I'm fine to sleep. And you mentioned Babyface. We got to shout him out because he's singing um America the Beautiful in the Super Bowl. Oh wow! Really? Mm Mm-hmm. That's all right. Babyface looked like a million bucks all Grammy weekend. He looked phenomenal. When don't he? 
<laughs> Maxwell, Neo, Keisha Cole, Mario, Stokely, Blackstreet, Carl Thomas, and Rakim. That might not be a bad show That's to a try a monster to. show. That's a nice show. What? Saturday? It says Stokely and not it's Stokely from Mint Condition, right? Yes. yes. What happened to Mint Condition? <laughs> they might not be in Mint no more. Well, Stokely mm. has an album out. I didn't know that. Stokely has an album out. So. That's crazy. That's a lineup, yo. It is. That's, like that's a that. panty dropper lineup right there. For, for sure. real, for real. I'd like to see that. A panty dropper? Yeah. <laughs> All right, man, another pod in the books. Y'all hold it down. Real niggas might be turning up this weekend. Mm-mm-mm. You know what I mean? Don't even invite me to the Super Bowl kickback if it ain't no joints over there, neither. I don't want to walk in and see you and your cousins, your uncles. Nah, what time the joints getting here? Third quarter? <laughs> <laughs> That's when I'll be around. You heard? Until the next time, we bid you adieu. Farewell. Adios. Arrivederci. Hasta la vista. Au revoir. Remember, life is a series of moments and moments pass. So let's make this one last as if it's all we have. Please stay safe this weekend. Call a friend, call a friend. Let them know that you love them and you care about them. Kiss your kids and keep the raisins out the potato salad. And all should be good this weekend. (laughs) Shout out to all y'all out there. Do remember the baddies, the insecure, the stagnant women want to travel. And the closed-minded women want you to teach them things. Grab you a Tylenol. You might need it. Going round in circle. Hey. Anybody do anything fun this weekend? What's up? Watch it. Nah, y'all turned down. Y'all not lit. Super Bowl. Uh, in the house with your girls and your kid. That's it. <laughs> I'm watching anime. Reading One Piece. You riding that One Piece shit to the to the world. To the, <laughs> milk it. Yo, once you find out the fans like something, that's all you on, huh? Run for shade. You've never heard of Joe Budden?